so let's look at our options here i have two upgrade components so if i wanted to upgrade our truck um there's nothing there's nothing that i can afford right now i could go for the extra prep station we could start to get towards this one which would be nice the problem is this one only becomes really good when you get it to max level at level four and that's kind of expensive is this only fires when you leave a stop? And when you leave a stop, I mean, I guess it makes the next prep work easier. I don't know. I think I should save my points. Because I think I will get more out of it if I invest into these things. So we'll just, we'll just plan for that. Start new day. So like I said in the tweet that went out, uh, we are in the first territory inside of Texas. But we have, I think, at least another, I think at least one more territory after that. Uh, for those who are good at numbers, you'll note that we're at about the halfway point. Generally speaking, I mean, obviously we don't have all we won't be able to reach all the levels in the game because some of them are locked behind certain uh, metal restrictions. Like this one requires six gold medals in this territory. That's probably not happening. This one requires ten. Some levels we just won't be able to reach. But in a general sense, we have uh, we've we're I would guess around the midway point as far as levels to complete. But we are, we are well, I'd say we're probably well into this game. I think I, I saw there's 11 territories total. So one, two, three, four, five, six. We're about to complete the sixth territory. So actually, from a number of territories perspective, we are past the halfway point. Because so we're going to be beating this territory tonight. We have this level. And then this one here. And then this one, this one. So that's four levels. And then the fifth one is the... Uh, is the, the one that, that leads to the exit there. So we have five levels in this territory, and then we're off to the, to the next area, next territory. So let's go ahead and jump into this one then. I uh, For those who were here last time, you might have remembered me saying that I was going to do a little bit of work off stream. I rarely, I don't really play a lot of games off stream nowadays, but I actually did go back off stream and, and I, I, I got silvers for a couple more levels just because we were a little bit behind the eight ball. I wanted to make sure we had enough to, uh, had enough to be able to complete this territory quickly in today's stream so i did a little bit of work off stream and that actually i had to redo one level three or four like two or three times and it let me get more crumb coins so now i can't let's see i think we have all we already have torta yeah we have all these things Oops. um but i can unlock tacos for the first time go and buy tacos let's go ahead and add it to the menu i'm a little bit intimidated because tacos are pretty complicated um actually going through oops that so let's have just one more holding station item let's make it real easy cookies nice and easy but uh yeah just you're gonna go like that's totally fine man it's totally fine thank you again to mystic soul for that very generous raid like i said mystic soul is a good old buddy of mine so uh, I, I he he's good people and he he brings good people with him and i appreciate you guys for stopping and hanging out with us it says 10 points needed that shouldn't be a problem we could do a number of kind of twos and threes orange fries are not too bad uh chili is a little bit tricky well, there's four holding station items. It's not too bad. Let's do... Uh, I don't really have a lot of other twos. We could do ribs. Let's go ahead and do chimichangas. I think it'll be fine. And then I need another two and another three. Let's do ratatouille. And... You know what? Fuck it. Let's go ahead and do chili. We can probably handle this. I'm going to do a quick practice for tacos. Because this is one of the hardest items in the game. So, beef and oil. This one wants chicken... Uh, yes. Yeah, chicken and oil. There's ground meat and beef and fish. Alright, so beef fajitas and then sour cream and then white rice is R, tomatoes is T, and then no onions, but they want lettuce, cheese, and corn salsa. Okay, that's not so bad. Chicken, sour cream, rice, tomato, onions, lettuce, cheese, pico de gallo. Bam. So that's the basic gist. Like, you, you follow the shortcuts, follow the instructions in the bottom there. What is cheese, mozzarella, and R for corn, O for corn. So that's the general gist. That's not so bad, actually. Um, of course, it's easy to say it's not so bad when things are kind of quiet in practice mode. When we get into a proper game, then the game gets stressful and weird and silly. All right, let's get I haven't played this in about mm, four or five days, so hopefully I remember the basic gist. Shoestring and wavy fries. Shoestring, that's, uh, that's Gracie's favorites. Uh, it's my, it's my wifey's favorite kind of, kind of fr french fry. Oh, I forgot the fucking last piece there. 
There we go. All right, let's get some chili going. All right. Oh, these are these are impatient people. It's one of these. All right, sugar. We need. But I don't have any chili. Uh oh, off to a pretty rough start. You know what? I'm actually gonna take a mulligan on this. I'm gonna restart that because I I fucked up the introduction the and I didn't notice Burn. that these are very Burn. impatient customers. So there's not much room for error at the start. So let's try that again. Curly, curly, and waffle, waffle. I'm gonna not fuck up the ratatouille this time. There we go. And then I'm gonna get the chili going. Oops. Uh, meat, uh, peppers, and corn. Cool. Fish and then oil. And get those going. Let's get one of these. Peanut butter. And this is chocolate chip. Bam. I'm gonna go ahead and dunk that. And then fish and then oil. Fish, sour cream, rice tomato, lettuce, cheese, and corn. You got it, fam. Alright, let's go ahead and get that. Uh, meat. What? Uh oh. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. No wonder. Fish, zesty, rice, beans, tomato, onion, and corn. Oh boy. Beef. Oh boy, it's... God damn it. I'm gonna try this one more time. I need to- I need- I might need to make an easier menu. This is really hard. I, um... I mean, we already gave it a fairly easy menu. But the impatient customers make this really really difficult. So, steak, french, shoestring. I'm usually not a fan of restarting all the time. But it's like I'm I'm being humbled with the level of difficulty. Let's actually make all the things: oil, meat, uh, red beans, good peppers, and onions. Cool. Meat and oil, peanut butter, candy, and sugar. And then this is dark chocolate chip. And this is gonna be chicken and oil. Okay. So chimichanga, red sauce. All right. Meat, sour cream, rice, tomato, onion, and guacamole is you. Very good. Off to a much stronger start. Sour cream, rice, tomato, onion, lettuce, cheese. There we go. I still dropped something there. Red sauce. There we go. Uh, there we go. So, meat. So, I think we did still drop a order. We do have... Um, I'm gonna go ahead and make more of everything, actually, while we're kind of waiting here. Uh, let's serve this now. Queso, rice, black beans is A, lettuce, mozzarella is Z, corn salsa. I should look, red salsa is R, pico de gallo. Okay, green salsa is G, okay. That was good. Oil, meat, peppers, corn and onions, okay. Oops. Oops. Okay, we have enough of that. Alright. Beef, and then dark chocolate, and then dark chocolate as well, and then regular chocolate, and then beef, and then beef, and then meat. Alright, beef, sour cream, rice, tomato, onions, lettuce, cheese, mozzarella, and green salsa. Alright. Regular chimichanga. Let's get beef, zesty rice. And what is the red sauce? Cool. Zesty rice. Oh boy, lots of drop orders. That's not good. Cheese, red salsa. Alright, so did have a number of dropped orders, although this the third stop should be a lot easier, so I think we're probably gonna be okay. No, I say that. Actually, I'm gonna make more french fries real quick. Uh oh, I fucked it up. Crap. Try that again. There we go. Yo, John, some happy Taco Tuesday. Oh, uh, that's right. We actually, we uh, we just got tacos in game, and it is indeed Taco Tuesday. How appropriate. I think that was probably enough for a silver. I guess we'll find out soon. Doing some knitting though, Johnson. That sounds nice. Hope you're feeling better, my friend. I know uh, we were, of course, hanging out in, in uh, Girl Vanna's chat a little bit earlier. Good job today. And it sounded like Keep things were tomorrow. feeling pretty good. So the fact that you're able to, to chill and, and knit hopefully is a good sign that you're on the mend from your surgery. 
That was pretty tough, but we managed, by the way, because we had we had less than eight overall screw-ups. So that's what allowed us to, to survive and get a silver, which is good. I mean, silvers are ideal. I mean, gold is the best, obviously, but, but gold is pretty hard to get because that requires a perfect day. And those are, uh, per that kind of, per that kind of level of perfection is fleeting. Anything I can unlock? There's several things. I can unlock pasta. I can unlock organic salads. Actually, there's all these things we can unlock. I think this whole... Everything after crab cakes is available to us. I'll ask this much. Does anybody have any requests? As far as things we can add to the menu. We already have pizza by the slice for the holding station. So pizza would be just a, the same version of that. Just in the special order instead. But we don't have uh, like Japanese crepes for instance. Those are probably amazing. Uh, we have a different kind of pasta. We don't have like regular pasta. We have regular salads but not organic salads. We don't have this kind of tofu. We don't have frozen lattes. We have regular lattes. We have a different kind of wok dish. Stuffed peppers, we don't have sashimi, quiche. So, a lot of this is pretty new. Feeling better, still not 100%, but, but getting there. You're taking it easy. That's reassuring. That sounds nice, Johnson. We have 11 points to our name, by the way. I'm, I'm thinking, what, what I'm kind of thinking is maybe frozen lattes, Japanese crepes, and that would leave us with four points, and then I would get maybe sashimi. That's kind of what I'm thinking. So, we get frozen lattes, we get ice cream with Japanese crepes, and then we get raw, raw fish. Have a good one, Dusty. Thanks for stopping in, bud. Thanks for hanging out with us and coming in from Mr. Mystic Souls Raid. Crumbly is level is a level five entry. That's kind of surprising. Go and buy this one. Uh, John Smith says pasta or stuffed peppers. Let's do. I can do actually. I can do both. I can do pasta, and I can do stuffed peppers. Now, actually, I don't know if I'm gonna add all these to the menu. Because those, <laughs> that's a pretty tough combo. Um, I will, I'm gonna do a quick practice of frozen lattes, just to see what they're like. So latte, mocha is O, vanilla syrup, uh, ice, and then milk, and then don't forget to cover. It's all in the same tab, which is kinda nice, except for the cover. Latte, white chocolate, ice, espresso. Sounds delicious, actually. Actually, oh, that's right, some of these don't have espresso, I guess. Interesting that it's called latte. I guess that's like just blended or uh, like steamed milk. I'm guessing latte. Yeah, yeah. I guess I guess it's the steamed milk. Well, because or maybe they mean it's a separate side of espresso. Like it already has the milk and the espresso in it. So in any case, latte frozen lattes are actually pretty easy. So not too bad. Let's see what stuffed peppers are like. Also a tier three shouldn't be too too bad. Just means the milk, maybe. Yeah, I mean, if we're being, if we, if I want to be pedantic, I would say that it would be, it would need to, it would need to specify, um, pepper or green pepper rather. Um, it would need to specify like, yeah, like steamed milk, cause, cause, it, cause steamed milk without an espresso is called a steamer. Not from Cleveland, not a Cleveland steamer. That's something else. So like, yeah, the, the name latte implies that it already has espresso in it, but maybe it doesn't for this particular case. Also, stuffed peppers, not so bad. Spinach and feta. And yeah, not too shabby, not too shabby at all. Yellow cut egg and cilantro. That's an interesting one. L for cilantro. That's gonna get me. That's got me in the past. L for cilantro has got me in the past. Latte is milk in it. Oh, really? That is good to know. So I so yeah, I need to rewire my expectations then. Whoop, oh, I didn't want to practice. Wanted to move that one. Let's try pasta. Pasta's the level five one. Pasta could be spicy. It's gonna be bow tie nudes. There's multiple sections, as you can imagine. Oh, sometimes they might want, saw, uh, like, meat. As you can see on the right-hand side, sometimes they want meat along with the nudes. Oh, fusilli and fettuccine have different shortcuts. Even though they look similar. Oil and then shrimp. They say onions. Uh, oh, it's in the second one. Spinach and peppers. And then just parmesan, which is R. This one I've already kind of fucked up. Broccoli, olives is V, peppers, and pesto sauce. Oh, it was this one I messed up. Yeah, they were not happy about that one. Then mushroom, parmesan is R, and then pesto sauce is E. So, bow tie, ole, and chicken. Whoops, I pressed the button too early. Bacon, broccoli, they're not gonna be happy about this. Alfredo sauce. 
Uh, Penne, so Penne is P. Oh no, it's Fusili and Fettuccini. Have different shortcuts. Fusili is S. Gotta remember, Fusili is a S. Fusili more like Fosili, am I right? Penne is P, can't really fuck that one up. Fettuccini is F, okay. I, I think we get the basic gist. Italian caf cafe latte, or cafe latte. Cafe a latte, all right, very nice, yeah. That explains it then, that explains it, yeah. This is premium pasta. That's right, because we've we've made other kinds of pasta in this game. I don't know if it's on this, like in this menu here, but the pasta we were making in previous instances, actually it should be on here because it says entire menu. Possible it was. Of course, there was risotto, which is kind of a. Yeah, it's kind of sort of pasta. Um, maybe it was a holding station pasta. Actually, there's, I guess there's a lot of things that are kind of spaghetti. Spaghetti is a pasta. Huh. I can't remember. I thought there was a, another kind of pasta thing. Because, yeah, this is like premium deluxe pasta. Fancy schmancy. It's not a search bar, isn't there? Oh, it's alphabetical. I just noticed that. Pasta salad, that's what I was thinking of. That's what I was thinking of, pasta salad. Yeah, okay. Oh, this is it, spinach vegetable pasta. Yeah, which we do have, we do have unlocked. Risotto is rice, yeah, you're right. It's it's more of a rice dish than, it's a, than it is anything else, obviously. So anyway, so yeah, we can, let's see, four holding stations and four special order stations. Let's do the holding stations first. We need 18 points. That's actually quite a lot. Um, do I know what... Um, I'm actually going to go... I'm going to back up real quick so I can see what the modifiers are. So impatient... So not angry customers, but impatient. It's not too bad. Impatient is not as bad as other things can be. So we need... So out of eight... We can get by with twos and threes. We don't need anything super crazy. I should probably do something challenging. Let's go... You know, let's go ahead and do the pasta. We just unlocked. Alphabetic, alphabetical. Let's go and do that one. I'll do some easier things for special orders to kind of, uh, kind of ease into it. You know what? We just got frozen latte. Well, maybe I shouldn't overdo it. Eleven points needed. Should I go and do frozen lattes? I guess. I guess like what better way to learn, right, than to just fucking yellow it. Red holding stations and yellow. So a, a food that is labeled with a red holding station can only be made with a holding station. Whereas food that is labeled with a yellow holding station item means it can be made on a per, on like a, on a per order basis. So like if you, you see me enter the screen, like with, uh, for instance, with chicken strips, where you show me, it shows me pl placing like several lists of uh, bundles of strips into baskets and then we press down all at once. If you have an order and you don't have any chicken strips available, you can do a batch or you can do just a single one, like uh, make one per order. So you can do just a single basket of it, dunk it, and then it's just for that one order. So there's pros and cons to either approach, but it means that the yellow ones are more flexible. The red ones, you got it. You, you have to make them in big batches, better for worse. Uh, we need eight points. We can just do a bunch of twos. We don't have to overcomplicate things. Let's do oatmeal. Let's do... Uh, Rote Grütze, if I'm, if I remember the pronunciation, we'll do, uh, let's do green papaya salad, little corn dogs. 18 point menu, frozen lattes and pasta for the first time. The pasta one is a, it's a little bit tricky. It's, I think pasta is probably easier than, than the tacos were probably. All right, chef. But we'll Show see when the got. chips are down. We'll see how things get when things get stressful. It's gonna be Currents, incoming food truck. Let me guess, it's the one that's gonna reroute me, I think. Uh, no, they're just gonna break my shit, which I do not appreciate. But we, we returned fire, and now they're dead. And who's laughing now, bitches? Like some onions. All right, not too bad. And then some corn dogs. And then, whoops. More corn dogs, all right. So, uh, fettuccine, oil and chicken. Those going, uh, cinnamon and almonds, 
cinnamon. Oh, that's good. Good, good, good. So, bow tie, oil and chicken. Very good. I'm gonna get this one really quick. Lice, no, I'm not lice. <laughs> Latte and ice. Not lice. Don't put lice on, on these things. That would not be good. Oh, whoops, they said nothing on theirs. I hit that up. Oh, this one, right. Chicken, parmesan, spinach, and uh, spinach is S, not N. Sometimes it's N. Ketchup, uh, mustard. Ketchup on that one. Ketchup and mustard. Ketchup. Nothing on that one. It's only a couple screw ups there. Not too bad, not too bad. Cook, serve, delicious. I'm, I'm down several holding stations, which is kind of a bummer. That's not Blackberry at all. I screwed it up. But I got in prints. And then more of this. Sunflower seeds, tomatoes. Um, I'm actually gonna go ahead and kill that one. So I can do more corn dogs. So we're gonna need to stop and make more at some point. Vanilla syrup, ice milk, cover. Next stop approaching. So that's to, oh, to Onigiri. Botai, oil, and chicken. So and cover. Vasily is uh, is S. Thought it was gonna be you for a second there. Uh, latte, uh, white chocolate, well, okay. cover. The cinnamon on that one. So we're gonna need to make more uh, rote grutze, raspberry. What's that shit? So bacon, olives, chicken, parmesan, tomato sauce. Onions and spinach peppers. Catch a mustard. Thumb there. Oh boy, it's getting a little bit silly. Oh crap, I messed that up. So we're gonna need more uh this. Okay, we barely rescued it, but I think we maybe had one thing get dropped along the way, but I think we're alright. Borote Grutza. Oh we got it. We also need more of this stuff. Sunflower seeds. All right, cool. We have just enough of these things. These things called hot dogs, or uh, corn dogs, whatever they're called. All right, so we'll need more oatmeal. We'll need more latte grutze. Right. And then I think we'll need more hot dogs. Oh, corn dogs. Genie is F. Oh, yeah, the Fettuccine versus Fusilli is gonna always mess me up. Mm, ice milk and cover. I'll tell you, white chocolate ice espresso and cover. All right. Uh, just Alfredo sauce, nice and easy. I like it. My kind of my kind of pasta, nice and simple. A simple pasta kind of guy. What can I say? Bacon, chicken, spinach, and alfredo. Right. Lots of stuff. Man, this is supposed to be the easy one. It's supposed to go easy on me for the last challenge. For the last stop. And this is the opposite of easy. Oh, I fucked up. That's okay. And Retigruzzo is done. Bam. Alright, so we, we did alright. We did alright. Got a little bit silly with the last couple of orders, but again, enough to get a silver. We'll take it. We will take it. Food truck swip. Yeah, it was Not swamped bad. in blood. Not bad. Yeah, that food truck attack. I mean, they they knocked out a couple of our holding stations, which is rude. But we returned fire and knocked out a couple of their skulls and fucking murdered them. So that's. I mean, them's food trucks, man. It's it's uh, it's rough out there. Check out a game called Space Chef, says Mystic Soul. I've never heard of Space Chef. Is it on Steam? Or, or will it be on Steam? Maybe it's a better question. So I've never heard of it. But if it's anything like this game, I mean, you can tell. I, I Even though this game does stress me out at times, I do very much enjoy myself. So I enjoy the the, the stress. <laughs> uh, eight foods required. It doesn't need a, a difficulty or, or a point amount. It just needs food. So let's do some easy things. Uh, garden salad is... I mean, the easiest, obviously. Um, I should do something kind of hard, though. I, should, I, I shouldn't let myself get too soft. I will do dosa, which is not so bad. 
Fa is kind of tricky. It's a high point amount, but it's it's actually not as bad as other things, I think. Um, let's look over here. Let's do fresh fish. I haven't done guys uh, gazpacho in a long time, and I should probably get get good with gazpacho. So I'll do that. That'll be my one heart thing. Do these Mr. Birds. So, um, I don't know. Gazpacho might be kind of tough, actually. I will do... I, mean, I think Seasick is really, really easy. Even though it's a three, I think it's kind of misleading. I'll do Sinigang and Akumbari. Akumbari. The earthy flavors, yeah. It's kind of like this, but it's in space. Oh, it's but it's like a first-person game. Interesting. And you have to hunt for the food. Oh, wow. So, it's that's a it's a farm to table, or I guess outer space to table, kind of thing. Yeah, I'll have to look that up. Actually, Mystic. So I've never heard of it, but All if it's right, an up-and-coming game, I'm always looking for for uh, recommendations and, and things to try out, things to check out at least. So one of these is gonna be pork and beef, and then green okra taro or taro. Oh, a is taro tomato. Um, we are the next and all the other stop. things, cool. And then Dosa. Nice and easy. So, W puree. What is W puree? Oh, it's just P for puree. Okay, cool. So Dosa's gonna be ready soon. Tilapia. Bam. Then season it. Don't forget to season. Uh, Dosa, tomato, and curry. Right. A dose of mint coriander. Boop. And mutton. Boop. And then what garnishes does this get? It gets a little bit of olive, olive oil, croutons, it's R, and then a pea flower. Pretty flower. I think it's pink. Pink, probably. Pink flower. So no, don't break any of my, my, uh, my stations, please. Please and thank you. Onions, green beans. Is this gonna be always all the thing, the same things? I think it is. I think it's always the same things. Okay, vegetable. All right, mackerel, which is K. I learned that the hard way last time. Um, P for puree. Q for puree. All right, this is gonna be oysters, caviar, and cocktail sauce, which is O. Oysters, caviar sauce, and cocktail. All right, I'm seeing a pattern here. Oyster. Uh, oysters, uh, caviar, and kimchi, which is K. Alrighty. Mackerel, THB. Albacore, THB. Alright, cool. Dosa, uh, mint. There we go. Uh, bean. And then this is gonna be milk, croutons, and blue flour. Cool. Uh, cilantro, which is L, and avocado, which is A, not V, like it usually is. Balsamic, avocado, oh, right, and then yellow flour. Cool. Dosa uh, chili is H. Dosa uh, tomato, B for beef curry. Onion and potato uh, for P. Right. Sonic, oops, avocado, and then small flowers. Tomato and potato. Uh, Dosa uh, mint and mutton. This might be a perfect stop, holy shit. Was well, a perfect stop. Ever. Now, it's not a perfect day. I think I already had one screw up earlier, but. Still, it's pretty nice. We're almost okay, just there. enough. Oysters and kimchi. Mahi Mahi is M. Yes. Little tomato. Oysters and what is that word? I don't know what that word is, but it's that one. It's that letter. Oysters, caviar, and kimchi. Curry, chicken, this botch is almost done. Oh fuck, maybe this has been a perfect day so far. I feel like I had one minor goof earlier, but I do not remember. Uh, milk, avocado, and yellow flour to go with the yellow curry. Or not yellow curry, yellow, yellow, uh, yellow uh, peppers, that's what it was. Chicken. We have eight stops. Oh my god, we're gonna be here for a minute. I just noticed eight stops on this one area. Uh, beef. We have our work cut out for us, my friends. Holy shnikes. Oops. 
Um, I'll make more of these. But we're gonna need to stop to make more of everything pretty soon here. Good thing we don't have super impatient customers. Uh, for this particular instance, at least. Heavy R and that one. Oh, that's the wrong sauce. Alright, so... If we had a perfect day... I don't think we did, but if we- if we did, I just- I just hecked it up. Bluefin! And this one's gonna be Cucumber. Bloop. Topia, one of my favorites. I say it every time, but it's true every time. Yep, I- I screwed up two things, actually, that time, but that's okay. Oysters, caviar, it's C... Mignonne sauce, Mignonette sauce, I don't know how, how it's pronounced. Um, let's go ahead and do... or this, real quick. So olive oil, and then lettuce, and then yellow flower. Cool. Uh, and then chicken. Alright, this is gonna be milk. Coconut milk, that is, and cucumbers and yellow flower. Cool. Lots of these dosa. Like, never, I don't even know what dosa is. Like, I'd never heard about it until I played this game, but uh, it looks really cool. Like, it, it, I'm, I'm very much... That was a long sauce. It looks very nice. I would like to try it. It seems simple enough, but I'd be down. Uh, garden salad. Alright. i do this real quick. So, oh, um, well, yeah, I might as well do that, but I'm gonna need, like, proper dust anyway, so I might as well make a batch. That's being made while we're at, we have some downtime, I'm gonna make... Actually, these are the easy things to make anyway. It's always the same things. Beef. So need one more of this. And then... I'll go ahead and do this instead. Ready? We're nearly there. Cocktail sauce. Get that going. Uh, the C. Whatever that C letter is. Uh, avocado, which is A. Horseradish is H. That's the first time we've had a horse horseradish run, I think. Kimchi. Yellow tomato. Yeah, not peppers, it was tomatoes. That's what it was. I was trying to think of the word for it. Uh, cilantro is L. And then corn. Alright. Cucumbers and blue flower. All right, so that was I think that was a perfect stop. Good. Not gonna. We don't have a ton of those as perfect stops, but we take them when we can. Oh, I screwed something up with that. Beef. So. Oh, I'm not sure what I messed up with that one. Radish and tilapia. Oh, I've got the seasoning. Whoops. That's okay. Salmon is S. I don't forget the seasoning. They're gonna be very sad. The lack of seasoning, but that's how it goes sometimes. That's how life goes. Sometimes life has a lack of seasoning and it's very sad. Yeah, they were they were very upset about that. Lack of seasoned fish, I'm shooketh. Were their very words. So many stops in this. Oh my god, we got a big one, too. Oops, wrong button. I'm actually gonna hold off on that for a minute. Um. Heavy R in this one. Heavy R in her Spanish. Red snapper art. Makes sense. Salmon. Samoan. This one. Tomato. And yellow tomato. And the bean. Black bean, probably. And cocktail. Bam. Dose and chili. Oh, I forgot the, the, the thing at the end. The curry. The meats. That is grounds for dismissal, are you kidding me? Will do, chef. This will be grounds for a public spanking. That going. Oh, this is ready. Balsamic and tomatoes and a pretty flower. 
Uh, cilantro is L. Cucumbers. Uh, olive oil and cucumbers. Need more. That. Need more of this other thing. We got it. At the last stop, we have one more. Okay, and then this one won't be quite as bad. Oh, I fucked that up. Try that again. Let's see if that's enough. Albacore. Cocktail. Kimchi. And what's this one? GL relish. Whatever the, whatever the G and the L stands for, we'll take it. Black bean, and then the black bean on that one. And then just those three orders of gazpacho, then we're out. We're out. Hunting the space kill. Yeah, yeah, with the, with the game uh, Sean was managing. But thank you again to Sean for that raid. Have a great night, man. Thanks for stopping in and chilling with us, buddy. And so that raid, you're a good, you're a good dude, man. I appreciate that. The thing about Sean is that he's a, he, oh, I screwed that up somehow. Um, he, he's much more, he, he's a, um, I don't know what time he starts, but he's, he is, he usually ends his streams at around the time I'm beginning. So he, he's a much more responsible lad than I am. That was a good attempt. But we know Which is a, which the only the one the main downsides with that is it means I never get to raid him because I'm always I always you know, start a little bit later obviously, so it's 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 mignonette mignonette sauce, minced shallots interesting. Dosa is a South Indian pancake style thing. Fermented batter, man, that's awesome, Jade. So yeah, you looked those up. Had had you heard of any of those before? The mignonette, mignonette sauce, and then uh, dosa. Because I would assume that for a lot of us, for a lot of us uh, America, North Americans, we're probably not as familiar. Yeah. I mean, that's one of the cool things about this game is that it, it does teach me a lot about all the things that are, all the kinds of food that are out there. Eight foods required. Um, actually, I know we were, I was, I, uh, I was just talking with Gracie earlier. Uh, she got a gyro sandwich from a place. Um, on, I think we went, went out Friday night. We got, uh, got some food at a cool restaurant nearby. So, since we Euros have been in conversation lately, we'll put Euros on the menu. And then I'll put one kind of complicated. Oh, I can afford Japanese crepes. Let's do it. In fact, I'm going to do a practice of Japanese crepes because I have no idea what they're going to entail. I think I've had Japanese crepes once. There was a place in St. Louis, I think on the loop, that, uh, that did these. I don't know if it's still around, but I would hope that it is, because I remember it being really cool. Kiwis, and then raspberries, and then the whip top. And then what do you do? Fold, and then roll three times. One, one, two, three. Whip, blueberries, kiwis, nuts, whip, fold, roll, 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 right. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. What? Uh, bananas, strawberries, strub coop, strawberry scoop. And roll, roll, roll. Cool. Do a couple more. Strawberry folds. What if you do like a filling and then whip? Oh, whoops! They didn't want blueberries. Uh, chocolate bits. Where are you getting it? You're getting those blueberries. You'll like it. Yeah, screwed that up. That's okay. Strawberries, vanilla scoop. Bananas, raspberries, whip. They're not that complicated, but there's a lot of possibilities, a lot of combinations. And of course, you know, make sure you push the, the button enough times. Uh, chocolate whip. Okay, we get the idea. Not too bad. So those would be, those would be. We have two four items, and once again, this one is just a matter of it needs enough food. So there's no comp there's no requirements for uh, complexity or anything. So we'll do some easy things. Do something kind of tricky. We already did chimichangas. So we could do tiramisu. Tiramisu is really not too bad. Um, let's do pizza by the slow. Well, that, that might be a bit much. Nah, fuck. Let's do pizza by. We can handle it. It's pizza by the slice. It's nothing. That's nothing, man. Everything else we have unlocked. Let's do. Again, I don't overdo things. Let's do a cure. 
Do chicken kiev. And then we'll do pork line. 20 point menu. Still, still pretty up there, man. This menu has got some teeth. It's got some fangs. My phone ding. I'm sure that wasn't anything. Important. Okay, cool. All right, Snap. let's get moving. Let's get the Euro meat. Bam. Frozen nanners. Egg rolls. Uh, all egg rolls, no spring rolls. And then pizza by the slice. Hand toss, queso, cheese, pep, beef, just be chicken and oh, oh, good thing it wanted bacon too. So I fucked it up, but that's okay. I'll wrap it and tie it. Swift chocolate, raspberry, strawberry, vanilla. Oops. Uh fold and roll it up. Um, and then meat, red cabbage, feta cheese, which is C. Aziki. Fold. Then meat, lettuce, red cabbage, tomatoes, tzatziki is Z. Don't forget to fold. Putting flowers and cranberry. And the pork blade's done. They were the first order and the last one out. Or pizza, please. Hand toss, red sauce, cheese. Ground beef is G. I gotta remember that. Mushrooms, onions, olives, peppers, and tomatoes. Uh, Gracie and I actually had um, pizza today. We, we, we went out to celebrate pie day by getting ourselves a pizza pie. Pretty nice. Got some. Got a bunch of leftovers too. Uh, bananas is B. Chocolate bits, kiwis, vanilla scoop. Full. Roll, roll, roll. Plain cut. Cranberry is C. Uh, cranberry rosé. Yes. Oh, it's R. Okay. A bit embarrassed. I just stared there for so long. Uh, flower cranberry. Cool. Wait, blueberries, bananas, strawberries, chocolate. Full. Roll, roll, roll. Cut apple. Bananas, chocolate, kiwi, strawberry. Eat onions, tomatoes, French fries. That is a fold. Cool. Just in the nick of time. French fries is F. Whoops. We get to fold. Lots of Euromeat, oh my god. Oh, I forgot the tzatziki sauce, crap. I pressed the button, but I, I think I was on the wrong I was on the wrong uh, tab. I made them sad. A lack of tzatziki sauce makes a lot of people sad, honestly. So yeah, same thing, yeah. That's exactly what it is. I pressed the tab, the space button too early. There we go. That's all right. Lots of meats left. Lots of meats left to make, that is. Spring and one egg roll. And then hand toss, red sauce, cheese, Ready? sausages, you. Our beef, parmesan is R, red and dice pack. Oh, I fucking pressed the wrong button like a dumbass. The last step, too. Thin crust, queso, cheese, mushroom, mushrooms, olives, spinach is S, red peppers, cool. That should do it. Uh, whip, bananas, nuts, raspberries, vanilla scoop. Uh, meat, onions, french fries, tzatziki, and fold it. Alright, cool. Meat, lettuce, french fries. Oops. We should be in good shape now. We kind of got past that first hump. Oh, except we need more pizza. Oh, I was one short earlier. I didn't even look. That's okay. Thin, pesto, cheese. That kind of pizza, honestly. That sounds nice. And green peppers. Bam. Oh, I fucked up pizza. Oh, no. Oh, no. What I, I don't know what I messed up. Cheese and pepper. There we go. Just the nick of time. I'm sure when I messed up the last time, I must have hit a wrong uh, shortcut. Oh, I forgot the goddamn tzatziki again. I hit on the wrong tab and I get too excited. Uh, there we go. Okay. We have four more stops after this. Holy crap. We gotta work it out for us. These long ass stops are not doing me any, my brain any favors. I fucked it. 
spring rolls. Don't fuck this. Don't fuck the spring rolls if you're given the choice. Make a conscious effort not to fuck the spring rolls if you can help it. Take it from me, a guy who's fucked too many spring rolls in his day. Learn from my example. Anchovies. Ooh, I don't know about that one, man. That's a, that's a that's a bit much for me, honestly. Anchovies and pineapple. I don't know, dude. That's a that's a hard that's a hard maybe from me. Alright. Okay, wrap, chocolate, kiwi, strawberry, chocolate, fold, and then roll it up. Oh, things are going bad. That's actually not good. I wasn't banking on things expiring on me. Maybe we'll be okay, though. They didn't want french fries on there. It's crap. Imagine not wanting french fries on your gyro, though. I mean, that's that just seems un-American. Well, it's not American. It's Mediterranean, but still, it seems un-Mediterranean. Uh, the idea of not of, of of requesting to not have french fries directly onto your uh, gyro. But at the same time, though, I mean, it, it is a lot more filling in that case. So maybe maybe they're not that hungry. I forgot to wrap it. It was an open face gyro sandwich. The hell's wrong with me? Screw that up, yep. Yeah. I don't know, my, my point stands. I have a hard time seeing how putting french fries like that, unfortunately. I, I see how, how, I have a hard time seeing how that lessens the Euro sandwich, but that's just me. That's just my opinion. And toast Alfredo cheese, that's a lot of cheese. Pepperoni, ground beef, and chimkins. Mushroom and fennel. I want the whole rigmarole. Same with this, this guy. This, the guy in front, the guy behind that guy in line said, "Wow, what he ordered sounded great. I'll have exactly what he just had." He inspired me. This guy, not so much. This guy was more more particular. Not this guy though. He wanted everything. That's happened to me, man. Sometimes I'll be like in line to order something, and I'll think, "Yeah, I'm all decided what I'm gonna get." And then the guy ahead of me orders something, and I go, "Fuck, that sounds good. I'll have what he's having or she's having or whatever." Damn, they got my ass. I was all decided, and then they inspired me. Oh, I screwed that up, so I, I was going so fast. I'm not sure I screwed up on there. Lots of bananas. So many bananas. And also a fuck ton of pizza, it seems. They're, they're really taking this whole pie day thing to heart, aren't they? Wouldn't that be cool if there was something in the game's code to be like, on certain days, the, the AI is more inclined to order certain things? I don't think that's what's going on, but wouldn't that be neat if there was something like that? Like, on certain holidays or on certain days of the year, calendar days and whatnot, the customers are, like, more inclined to order certain things. Um, but again, I have no, I have no basis for, for such a, an assertion. There is something like that in Noita, though, um, where uh, certain enemies are more likely to show up on certain holidays and certain days of the year. Um, the big one that a lot of us know about is um, the Heart Mimic is most is much more likely to show up on Valentine's Day, of all things. However, it's still extremely rare, so um, the chance is higher, but it's still not ex it's still not exactly a, a high chance, but higher. I heard it's not mean much, but because it's still like the, the rarest enemy in the game by a wide margin. Although, with the most recent patch, they did make it so that um, it's uh, that, that chest uh, like contents, like randomized chest, chest contents are more balanced. Because previously there was a, uh, a known bug with how the, the chest contents were randomized. And so there's been a, basically a bunch of bug fixes, uh, bug, bug fix patches lately. Is that a perfect stop? It was a perfect stop. Hell yeah, baby, it was. It do be that way. 
just gonna go ahead and kill that one. Pesto six spring and one egg roll. And then more pizza, hand toss, pesto, cheese, anchovies. Again, anchovies, man. I don't know. Uh, I think I fucked it up. Yeah, I fucked it up. Shit. Hand toss, red sauce, cheese, sausage, ground beef, parmesan, uh, red pepper, and diced tomato. Cool, now we got it. We need to make one more, though. This is cheese, ham, and parmesan. Cool. Ooh, an apple or an apricot. Ooh, shrimp seasoning. Oh, crap. That's okay. We have flowers and cranberry. We got it. Something just went bad, which I was not counting on. Oh, they didn't want feta on that one. Oh, fuck, I forgot to wrap it. Oh, I didn't, they didn't want french fries on the Man, so many small screw-ups with these. This actually might be a bronze. Just because I feel like I've had a lot of goofs. The problem is the fold button is the same button as the french fry button. I think that's part of what's getting me. That's Eki on there. So like even though I'll press the right button, I'll, I might switch to the wrong tab too quickly. I have to be much more deliberate with my button presses. That was rough. Is it a bronze? Oh, we're, we're not done. We have one more. Okay. I thought that was the last one. So it should be a lot easier though. Looking at the list. Hand toss, red sauce, cheese, ham, and pineapple. Oops. They say, I want I want all of it. They say, give it all to me, big daddy. Traditional half a season. Cranberry and rose, or rose rather. Is it literally roses, I wonder? Hope they, hope they dethorn them at least. There we go. Yeah, the trick seems to really be just be very deliberate with my presses and don't press too quickly, don't like go too sloppy. It's easy to overdo it. Perfect stop. Good. Good, good, good. Sauceless Euro, yeah. I I mean I love I I I like a good Euro sandwich, but I, I was saying earlier, I'm not a huge Tatsiki guy, I actually prefer, if there's other kinds of sauce options, I will usually go for, um, for like if there's like a spicy sauce, like I'll usually go for a non Tatsiki sauce. If you, had, if you had to wash hands every time you handled raw meat, there's actually a thing like that in Cook, Serve, Delicious too. There's a separate step for sanitize, sanitizing your hands with, um, with some of the chores. Because in Cook, Serve, Delicious too, you have chores. You have to refill the ice machine. You have to change out the trash compactor. You have to, uh, like, I, either you have to refill the, the drink machines. There's, like, just various things like that in Cooks of Delicious 2 that they removed in this game. But, yeah, there was a specific sanitize button where you, you would show, like, them hitting the little, um, hand, hand sanitizer, hand soap button. By the way, this one's gonna be a doozy. Maybe it's rosemary. You know what? That's probably it. That's probably it, yeah. Fold in their own euros. Yeah, it was an open face euro sandwich. Jade says a creamy pie. Yes, it was a well, it was a pizza pie, but it was, it was a, uh, it, it had, actually no, it it was a it was a weird one. It was called um, it was like a Thai pizza. It had, like a Thai some Thai seasoning, and like a like a sweetened. It was like a weird sweetened chili sauce. It was odd, and I liked it a lot. Gracie was kind of so so one, but I really liked it. She also got a really nice uh, mushroom soup. But uh, but yeah, good stuff though. It was about the egg rolls that I- yeah, I, I did script some egg rolls. Oh, because I had fucked some egg rolls, right. There's a lot of egg rolls that were- that got, uh, violated in, in that, uh, in that particular instance. Yeah, fucking the egg rolls. Oh, and the creamy pie is probably about that one time I- I-, I the story I told about 
going with Gracie to get some, uh, to go to a really nice restaurant that was known for make, making really good pies. And she was like, and I was, and she was like, well, they have good apple pies, but we should get, we should get one of the cream pies because it's hard to do a good cream pie. And I, and I must have made a face because she was like, don't, don't you say it, Alex. It's hard to do a good cream pie. And I was like, says you sometimes it's too easy but oh that's 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 another story for another day also playstation fan good to see you bud hope you're doing well we're playing some cook serve delicious this is a cool little indie game that is really good it's it's really good and there's lots of different foods in the game it gets a little stressful sometimes but that's part of the joy alfredo mozzarella right it was called oh this the name of it in game was called creamy pie that's a lot of cheese man alfredo mozzarella and parmesan like damn I know there's also a queso cheese sauce, so it's like, that's that's intense. Let's do stuffed peppers. We just got that unlocked recently. I don't have enough to afford the beef and pork wok dish. We need 15 points, which is not a small amount. We could do... Well, let's, let's not get too ahead of ourselves. We have a lot of holding station. Actually, one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's do... Oh, man, if I could avoid the king potato, I... I, I mean, I'll, I'll do it. I'm just not a fan of the king potato. It is extremely stressful. <laughs> seven points. Can I get seven points out of this? I probably could. Because we have a lot of options. Well, not a ton, but enough. Beef Wellington isn't too bad. Of course, we just did pork loin. We could do pot pie. We could do frozen lattes. We just did frozen lattes. Or just unlocked it for the first time. Um, could do beef Wellington. Could do smoothies. Smoothies aren't too bad. Let's do smoothies. Smoothies and frozen lattes in perfect harmony. Smoothie, frozen latte, stuffed pepper food truck. That almost served beef wellington and pot pies and whole cakes. Have some fun today. Just a little bit of fun though. Don't, let's not get too ahead of ourselves. Food truck incoming. Hang on. Uh oh, I don't like that noise. I don't like that noise. Oh, it's these assholes. Yeah, I have no idea what <laughs> what we need, so I'm just gonna make one of everything and hope for the goddamn best. Um, all right. Did I do it right? Yeah, that's it. Yeah. They want German pretzels, and then they want corn. All right, so let's get these ice, soy milk, uh, uh, bananas, blueberries, apples, and cover. Right, couscous is O, and then feta is F, as it should be. Yogurt, ice, orange juice, orange, pineapple, and cover. Will do, chef. Egg and cheese. Spinach is S, and feta. Feta mo better. Uh, meat and cheese. This, uh, caramel, ice, milk, and cover. Oh god, they are very impatient. One of these kinds of deals. Oh, it's they want, um, they want pretzels. There we go. That's what I was screwed up. So I think I dropped maybe one order because I, I missed what they wanted. They wanted pretzels, not corn. Uh, while we're waiting, I will go ahead. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how much of a thing to make. I'm going to make more medivic. And then I'm going to make... Probably more of this. Blueberries and raspberries and cover. Just goose and cheese. Oh, not feta, but regular cheese. I screwed that up. Latte, vanilla, ice, and milk. This went bad, so I'll make more pretzels, probably, right? Um, ba 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 ba. Oh, no, we need, we need this thing. Muska. More of that. Milk, uh, ice. Oh, um, latte. I forgot about the latte. And then ice and then milk. And then cover. I think I got that alright. Meat and the cilantro. Latte, ice, espresso. No milk, oddly enough. Yeah, I did screw up one of those. Egg and feta. Oh, that was the one I knew I screwed up those. That's okay. Getting more ratatouille. Okay. 
We need more pretzels. I knew that was gonna come up. I, I know it was. While we have some downtime, let's make some more other things. I'm feeling more of this. That's about to go bad. And then probably more corn. Just seems like the corn thing we have. We have a hard time keeping it in stock. So might as well. And that piece just went bad. Um, make more of this. We're almost there. Oh, I screwed that. It was the wrong order, right? Goose and cilantro. Spinach is S and cilantro. Oh, I forgot to cover it. Whoops. Press the wrong button. Thought it was wrap, not not uh, not cover. Strawberries, watermelon, apples. Yes, that one was less than less than perfect. Cover that. So sure enough, we need this thing. Gotta be in that specific order. It's very, very particular. Rice and cheese. What did I do? Oh gosh, I dropped one door, but that's okay. Okay, so one order drop, that's not the bestest, but not the worstest either. Those guys served. I don't know how much. Oh, all right, pretzels. We should definitely serve pretzels or prepare pretzels. Um, what else? Probably more medevic. And then I'm just gonna guess more corn. Always more corn. Always, always. Two strawberries, oranges. Cover that shit, of course. Avocados and kale. Green smoothie. Kiwis, oops, strawberries and oranges, and then cover that shit. Alright, there we go. Oh, I forgot to I forgot the kale. I'm sorry. So another more more small mistakes here and there. It's adding up, but we're probably okay though. We have some downtime. We have one more stop, by the way. One more stop. Let's make more of this. Muska. More pretzels, German pretzels this time, and then last but not least, let's make probably just more corn. Let's make more of this, actually. Kind of a gamble, but we'll see if it works. Latte caramel is A. Yes, it is. Ice milk, and then cover. Special orders are coming in very slowly, so this last stop actually might not be too, too bad. Oh, that was it. Okay, wow, last stop was kind of a wet fart. But that's okay. I'd rather a wet fart than a painful fart. We'll take this over. That means we are done with this territory. Great job today, chef. I can just leave the water in front of me. I'd rather it end with a wet fart than a painful fart. I want the I want it to be a pleasant fart. What's up, awful world? Last stop isn't too bad. You're right, actually. Yeah, you're right. It really wasn't too bad. Because, yeah, sometimes the last stop was kind of a doozy. That had a lot of modifiers on it, but it really wasn't too bad. Thanks for joining hey, in, by the way, Awful World. Yeah? What do you think Chef will do after the competition? Like we're sleeping. What do you mean? In the little storage yeah, area. We win. Do you think Chef will really open another luxury restaurant? Well, yeah, probably. I mean, there's only so much you can do with a food truck. Hmm. What's up? No need for a driver in a luxury restaurant. I, uh, I guess not. Oh, are we gonna abandon our best friends? Our only friends? I, I'm sure we'll be able to find a job. We'll need a delivery driver, maybe. If our restaurant pops off, we'll need somebody to deliver orders. A glitter appearing in the horizon. Multiple private jets. Luxurious country of Grandview. Is that where we are? We're in Houston, Texas. Grandview. I'm guessing that's like an area. Hold on. We have Demi Glaze, Calypso, Cream Dollop, Coffee Toffee, Lumberjack, Sketchy, Endurance, Endurance, Late Service. These aren't the names of Ambrosial. 
Yeah, look at all these modifiers. Holy shit. VIP, I'm guessing that's like a new modifier then. Maybe that means we're like getting close to the final areas because... Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. We've completed six out of, I think, 11 total territories. We're on the seventh. This one's got a bunch. A lot of, uh, a lot of areas in this territory. And yeah, I'm seeing some new icons we've never seen. I've never seen the VIP one before. I think, if I'm recalling from Hooks Over Delicious 1, and maybe 2, but I think it was definitely in 1. There was like, high profile customers where if you got their order right, it was good. And if you got the order wrong, it was extremely, extremely bad. So it's like high stakes orders you cannot fuck up that you have to prioritize. Most dastardly, yeah, Awful World knows, man. Awful World's like, oh fuck, he has no idea. And you're right, I have no idea what I'm getting myself into. Holy snackies. So we just want food on the menu. We don't need fancy food. Although, you know what? I will unlock organic salad. Because that's, that's something we've... I, I've been wanting to unlock. Let's do a quick practice of it to see what it's all about. Probably not going to be too bad. It's a, it's a four, not a fiver. Some mushrooms, apples, grapes, onion sprouts. Onion, sp onion sprouts, interesting. And then uh, L for almond. Tomatoes, broccoli is probably R. It's B. Cucumbers, apples. Sometimes it's B, sometimes it's R. Apples, grapes, tangerine. Tangerine is N, not T. Good to know, good to know. Sunflower seeds and blue cheese is B. Tangerine is it's L, I think. Or it's N, rather, N. And L for tangerines would make even less sense. And almonds. Peppers, apples, grapes, strawberries, tangerines, N. Sunflower, avocado. Okay. So the strawberries, sunflower, pecans is P. Blue cheese. Ooh. Not too bad. Mechanically identical with more ingredients. Yeah, yeah, I was going to say, it, it seems pretty familiar, but with just more options, which is just how it goes sometimes. We'll leave it on the menu for now. We'll do some other simple things, because there's a new mechanic here that I'm a little bit scared of. Grilled chicken sandwich, you know, the, like I've said before, the burgers, the burgers aren't too bad, but the chicken sandwiches are sometimes hard for me, because the short, especially if there's multiple of them in the same menu. But I think we'll be okay. So we'll go real simple for those. We're doing something new with organic salads, so we'll do... We've already done onigiri and cookies. Let's do lolo, lulu, and then desert, dessert shooters. Not not desert. I fuck. I fuck that up every time. Dessert shooters, not desert shooters. Desert shooters. I'm gonna eat a bunch of sand. Delicious. All right. Let's see this new VIP mechanic. I'm. I bet it's gonna be similar to the one from Cook Serve Delicious. Either one or two. Prosperous stop on our trip, Grandview County, aka Houston. We're in Houston? You know, this place was a real piece of work back in 2020. Nothing made sense, and it took 30 minutes just to travel a mile. It's a real pity this place didn't get nuked. Well, honestly, it hasn't totally changed for the better. Some people here can be a bit unfriendly towards outsiders and low income workers, so I'm thinking just to be safe, we'll stick to outside the city limits. What? Whisk, how do you expect us to get any customers if we don't get into the city? Oh, um, just take us in, and if anyone complains, they can deal with me. Your funeral. So that's kind of an indicator, I think. A hint of what's to come. Yeah, I screwed up one of those. VIP. So that means you'll get special orders that come in after... After you've parked, right? So that's that's the mechanic then. Pretty dashly. It's actually not quite as bad as I was thinking it would be. Oh god. Oh wow. But except I I I had foolishly said some pretty tough things. Whoops. Oh, they're very impatient too. Good to know. Good to know that you don't have much time to to dawdle. Guys, I think I might have screwed that up a little bit. So I think I dropped one order, and I think I screwed up another one. Nicely done. But yeah, yeah, Awful World called it that that's going to be definitely a tricky one. So we need to be very aware of what kind of special orders we're, special order foods we're encouraging or including, and recognize that that could come back to bite us when we're dealing with the holding station items and having to slap those in for good measure. Something new. It's a new mechanic. Only a matter of time before that was to. Rear its head. The next stop. stop sign might be more difficult, but 
VIP is more dashedly though. Yeah, yeah, stop sign is, what is it, uh, angry customers, I think? Yeah, angry customers is pretty rough. This one, I like your phrasing for it. It is indeed quite dashedly. Um, I, I, I think it's all about trying, and, and sometimes it's gonna be hard to do, but trying to craft a menu that has some wiggle room when you've got like the VIP folks coming in. You know, if I've got like a lot of fairly complicated, um, fairly complicated special order foods interspersed with some, uh, you know, some not as bad uh, special order foods or holding station foods. Then that could get back to bite me. So I guess it's a matter of making sure it's like somewhat balanced. Don't like put all the complicated points in special order foods and think I just got to squeeze through it because yeah, there, there's that matter where that it might come back to bite me if I put all my eggs in one basket, so to speak. I think I screwed up something real. Oh, I, it was probably it was probably this one. Yeah, blue cheese's bee. And a couple, like, unhappy people, and I'm not sure what I was doing wrong. There must have been a shortcut I was screwing up with the organic salad. Mushrooms, broccoli is B, apples and avocado. Right. On it, chef. Cucumbers, apples and avocado. That's always so satisfying. Out of egg. I think we knew that was coming. And we have one more stop after that. Our cinnamon rolls are about to go bad, but that's okay. They just did go bad. They, they don't last very long. They are real quick. Go ahead and make more of these. Lots of beans. So many beans. Holy moly. Many beans, a little time. That will not be enough. That should be enough. Got a... Oh, fuck. The tangerine thing. Every damn time. Every damn time. Yes, that's going to be not so great. Dreams, apples, grapes, strawberries. That's what I screwed up there. Oh, banana. That's what it was. I thought it was banana cream. I misread. Cinnamon buns. Bam. Hoping this will still be a silver. I've had a couple of goofs. But I'm hoping this will be enough to get by. I'm holding on to my ass. And silver. All right, we'll take it. Yeah. Silvers in, in this game, silver medals in this game, is the equivalent of C's get degrees in well, real life, chef. that is. Uh, a for effort. And an A in my heart. Well, it's not so bad. It's I thought I had more screw-ups than that, but class, just two, chef. just four total. I thought I had that many red screw-ups, like big bad screw-ups. Johnson says, I'm working my ass off making some, uh, doing some crocheting. Some needles, some needle blockers, and food. That is a fantastic idea the food one especially just don't get them confused and start eating the needle dropper the, the needle blockers rather uh more trinkets nice that was finger lick and now we have thirds and variety pack the king potato man that king potato is staring me down and i'm nervous i'm a nervous nelly let's actually start with the special orders so yeah i don't have these three things Let's do, I mean, I don't want to go too easy on myself because I I know that the game is going to ramp up the difficulty even more. I mean, this game is, has been a series of difficulty spikes followed by more difficulty spikes followed by more difficulty spikes. So I, I need to like get good and I don't want to get, too, I don't want to go too easy on myself, but King Potatoes scare me. <laughs> I mean, I, I've dealt with them plenty of times. We, we can deal with them in any, if need be, but I'm... 
then maybe it try to go a little bit. I'm trying to gonna try to be nice to myself, so to speak. So we'll do a combination of some harder things. I mean, jambalaya is not too bad. Pot pie is not too bad. Bunny chow is pretty easy. Someday, that's right. That's right. If I want to go for two iron chef, the honest answer, awful world, is that I probably will not go for like the 100% playthrough just because if I want to go for all golds, it would take me probably hundreds of hours. You've probably noticed when I'm playing this game, I'm, I, I like to think I can get by, but I am not great at this game. At this game, it would be, it would be, I, I would need to, to uh, put in some work on this one, and I, I don't know if I have the patience nor the uh n nor the the what, what's the word i'm looking for all those things um i don't know if i have the acumen you know to 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 handle it all what that noise means this is give me the kringle pretty please and thank you except they probably didn't say pretty please and thank you. they probably demanded it because they're vips they're full of themselves Beep, boop, beep, boop. Hit that icing. That bunny chow takes forever, doesn't it? You did it? Overall, that's amazing. 100%. I'm almost afraid to ask how long it took. Because... I, um, I... One of my, uh, one of my, uh, one of our viewers, a couple, uh, I think it was last week, actually. I can just press all the buttons. And then only look at the bottom, I think, at the end. Oh, I'm wrong. I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have just pressed all the buttons. So sometimes it is more particular. Just cover it. But yeah, anyway, uh, one of my buddies, one of our viewers, last week sent me a video. They posted it in our Discord server. Oh, they didn't want chicken. No, that's okay. They're getting there. You didn't want chicken, but you're getting it, all right? Um, they looked up a video of somebody playing the hardest challenge in the game. Really, the, the, the final challenge in the game. Um, on standard mode, you know, so, so hard mode, so to speak. Cover that shit. Um, with the hardest, um, just going with the hardest combination of menu items, or at least all, basically all five tier menu items, and uh, and doing it perfectly, so not having a single screw up. And needless to say, it was as amazing as it was terrifying. To behold, Need more of those things. Don't that shit. Like, watching their speed, watching their ability to, to navigate the menus and not have a single screw up. I mean, it was it was really something special. And of course, this was the final challenge in the in the game. Final stop in the game, rather. So, we're talking... Remember that one? We're talking, like, 40 plus, I think, it was what it was. It was a 40 plus... Um, uh, requ requirement for the menu. Oh, Sopapillas again, goddamn. Sopapillas. Cover it, alright. Oh, I didn't need to do that, that's okay. So the fact that you, yeah, you pulled off the 100% means you would have had to have done that final, that last challenge with 100% success, getting a gold rating for it. I mean, that's, that is a, itself just, it's just is exemplary. 120 to 140 hours. Yeah, it's actually not as bad as I was thinking. I feel like it's going to take me about that long just to beat this game. I'm only slightly exaggerating, but it, it's taken me a long time. I think I'm probably, probably about one fourth the way there, I would guess, the way, at the rate I'm going. Part of it is that, uh, you know, I will confess that there is an added difficulty to streaming it because I... Oh, why do I make so many batches of... Oh, it's because we need a lot, yeah. Uh, there is an added difficulty when I'm streaming it because I... You know, you've probably figured out by now, I'm, I try... I don't always succeed, but I try to narrate as I'm going. And it is very easy for me, at least, to get mixed up in my thoughts. Oh, they didn't want chicken, but you're getting the chicken anyway. It's called a chicken pot pie for a reason, goddammit. This guy wants, yeah, he wants, he wants the full Cadillac and the potatoes and the cover. Chicken, carrots, and celery, and cover. 
don't want everything on this one. Not everything. I lied. Right. Yeah, I screwed up one of those. Waffle going. Oh. And just cover, all right. Need more fluffle. enough spaghetti we're, we're slinging a lot of spaghetti but we are nearing the end of the stop icing on that puppy start that guy should i make anything while we're waiting yes Cook, serve, delicious. just gonna go ahead and drop that one real quick make it some more room one more batch of falafel we're good and i think oh, whoops I'm sure i actually did, i don't need that second one i screwed up do some peas God damn it. Ready? We're nearly there. Now we're good. Also, it's tricky whenever I am trying to narrate and, and provide commentary for the, as, as I'm playing this game. I also want to keep up with chat, which is ex which is increasingly hard. What usually ends up happening is that I, I fall behind and then catch up after the, the, the day is done. Not the actual day, but like the the end game day. Oh, they didn't want they didn't want potatoes in that. They're getting it. They're getting the potatoes. They're gonna like it. Um, cover that shit. Corn, carrots, and then there we go. Not too bad. A lot of things cooking right now. Just the cover. A lot of these special order. Pot pies coming in hot, man. This seems like the special order pot pies are all the rage right now. Like they're going out of style, which is physically impossible because there's no way that such a thing could go out of style. They're too popular. Whoops. Everything else is cooking. We have one more stop. I'm going to assume we'll need more sopapillas. It's in the falafel. And then probably more jambalaya. More spaghetti. Just gonna go ahead and drop that one. Awful indeed. Oh, bunny chat, right. I forgot what I clicked. I was like, wait, this is a this is a weird pot pie. It's because it wasn't a pot pie at all. No one, right? And my, my brain kind of shut down. I was like, what, is, what kind of pot pie is this? What ingredients are these? So it's not bad at all. That's why. Okay. We're, we're getting there, man. We are getting there. Oh, chicken. This is everything. Oh, I've got the potatoes, though. They're going to be so upset. Lack of potatoes, that's my that's my bubble bass moment right there, man. No potatoes. No, problem, chef. no potatoes, SpongeBob. I'll be ruined. The embarrassment will will bring me to complete complete breakdown. I need more spaghetti. Spaghetti. Sure. 
after I click my buttons very deliberately because I don't want to misclick. Then I'll be even more upsetty. Alright, spaghetti is going. We are nearing. Yeah, we're almost good. Oh, it's because our spaghetti went out. That's why. It went, it went bad. Alright, we got there. Woo, buddy, we got there. Battle Scarred Veteran, that's right, man. I, um, I've um i played all through 1 and 2. Cooks are delicious 1 and 2. But I never, I didn't like 100% them. I just played through them and was like, alright, that's enough for me. Yeah, in fact, here I can bring up the exact numbers. As far as playtime. So... Cooks of Delicious 1. Uh, 28 hours. Not too bad, not too bad. Cooks of Delicious 2, 33 hours. And this one is already at 37. Yeah, so we're at 37, and we're a little bit past the halfway point. So this will take, yeah, I, I'm guessing at least 60 hours. That's the rate we're going. So yeah, we still got... Still got quite a long ways to go. That is the wrong... Uh, overlay, I think. Oh, wait, no, that's that's it. That's it. Um, yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I'm mistaken. But we got to level up. We got another upgrade component, and we got a singular crumb coin. Vegetarian, they got chicken in their bed. Exactly, exactly. They're, they, they're fine. They're fine. It's a perfect score on the final level with maximum point. But yeah, so all, I guess all fives, really. All, all five menu. Menu selections. They let you choose. Yeah, they let you choose at least, but still. But still, that's pretty spicy. Oh, by the way, now that I have three upgrade components, I can do some upgrades. And actually, maybe Awful World, you would be able to provide. I, I'm definitely down for suggestions. I haven't really committed all the way on any single thing. I've done a little bit of cooking time regulator, done a little bit of special system analyzer. Actually, no, I guess I've maxed that out. But, so I, never mind, I guess I have gone all the way with one of them, at least. I haven't gone into food truck reinforcements at all, and you know what? Maybe I should. Maybe I should, because sometimes that is an awful, annoying thing to have to deal with. Um, I haven't gone into the rejuvenator yet. I've done a little bit with heat lamps. Um, the serving cloner I've done a little bit of. Yeah, maybe, I'm actually thinking maybe the reinforcer would be good. The holding station, yes, the holding stations. Yeah, that was the first thing that I wanted to go for. Especially because just the, the flexibility it offers is nice. Ram base attacks, super attacks. I don't think I've seen super attacks yet. I'm, I think I'm going to start to invest into this one. So the fact that we won't lose holding stations is really nice. You didn't, you didn't need it necessarily. I bet once I... I don't know what super attacks are. I bet once I see a super attack, I'm going to be like, oh, fuck. I'm guessing it's probably lots of things. So, like, lots of effects. So, yeah, we'll see how long I'm able to hold out. But uh, but not losing holding stations will be nice, because, like you said, having max holding stations is good, and when you lose them temporarily, it's like, oh, fuck. And now, now I'm, like, having to work with a... with a, with a wounded limb is what it feels like. Uh, by the way, we do have VIPs. We have also mouthfeel. Mouthfeel. Yes, t tell me all about how the... How the mouths feel. Um, let's do... Let's see, just need... We need points. We could do pasta again. Pasta wasn't too bad. Let's do bibimbap. Because I could probably use more practice with it. I want to do torta, or do I want to just do... There are VIP. Oh, man. A VIP torta would be kind of potentially horrible. Let's do... do oh, wait, no. Oh, no, this is holding station. Never mind. Um... Oh, fuck. That means bibimbap could be a special order. Ooh, that could be tough. I guess I prefer it though to pasta. Well, let's try it. I could always, could always do something else. Let's do fruit salad and this thing, just because I don't remember much about it. Makes you play. It does. It makes absolutely does. We could. We could. You're right. Yeah, I could always lose some prep stations. We did that at one point. I, I added it back, but you might have noticed I don't have the maximum number. I think I've I've two disabled right now. But I could always up the ante if I needed to, and it would lower the point values. It is using it looks You're right, you're right. I think the main thing is the egg. If I recall correctly, it's either raw egg or fried egg, and then meats. Obviously. The meats is the big thing, but But I think you're right. I think it's not as bad as I think as I'm making it out to be. Also 
We, yeah, we really have to do the. the uh, well, that's not true. We, I could do a three. I could do pork loin again or frozen lattes. Let's do frozen lattes again. I could I could use more practice with that one. We'll do um, stew and tibule. A little bit of a spicy menu, but we'll be all right. Four different recipes. Yeah, I think you're. I, I'm pretty sure you're right. It's. I think it's like the egg is different, and of course the meat selection is different. But the meat is the first thing you do, so. I think looking at the shortcut and then picking the egg, that's like the other last thing. Like for the second half, that is. Uh, beef, potatoes, and peas. Uh, beef, carrots, and peas. Alright. Uh, couscous, potatoes, cauliflowers. Cauliflowers A, and then parsley is B. Bulgar. I'm not, not to be vulgar with my bulgar. Sounds like I'm saying burger. Uh, cantaloupe, tangerine, strawberry kiwi. Um, nice seasoning and lid. No ground beef? Alright, no ground beef. I'll take it. And cover. Oops, cantaloupe, apple, tangerines. Uh, seasoning lid. Yeah, no ground beef. That's kind of surprising, actually. Cantaloupe, tangerine, strawberry kiwi. Strawberry kiwi. Alright, cool. So, tofu. Then I think I just turn my brain off and just press all the buttons. Uh, and then they want the fried egg, bam, and then red sauce. Yeah, so that's nice and easy. Latte, right, so, right, so, right, so, and cover. I think I, yeah, same thing. I think I just turned my brain off. And then they want the fried egg, probably. Yeah, nice and easy. Yeah, grapes, cantaloupe, and uh, apples, and oh, uh, well, good thing it's in it's in mixed order. I pressed the wrong button, but it actually worked out okay. Congratulations! A good start. Look at that. I'll assume that the reason that went, that round went so well is because we have Off the World in the chat who is very, very good at this game, and your experience with this game is being absorbed into my brain like a like a like osmosis, and that is why. No, no pressure. If you leave, I'm gonna fall apart and I'm gonna piss my pants like a little piss piss pants piss baby. I'm 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 mostly kidding. No pressure. No, you you can leave anytime you want. I, I'm just fucking around. The joke's on you. I actually pissed myself like 12 hours ago, so it's okay. I got that out of my system much, much earlier. As you do. Lots Your of stew. Oh boy. Let's do that again. Let's do that again. So much stew. Goddamn. Garbanzo is G. It is. I'm an OG Next when it comes to Garbanzo. There's cauliflower. Cut parsley. I always think cut parsley is C. See, Sinor. Strawberry kiwi. Water. Man, what is it with these people who are just allergic to ground beef and their baby bop? Know what that noise means? They want the fried egg. They want the raw egg this time. And we take the. Oh, it's garlic, not yeah, not ground. Okay, same thing. One man's ground is another man's garlic or something. All right, so no cooked tofu this time. And they want the raw egg. Like how I'm spelling ASMR when I tap that out. Fried egg, bam, almost pressed the wrong button. I've been awfully embarrassed. No tofu in this one. Oh, I still fucking pressed the button. That's okay. I think this actually was going to be a- yeah, I, I fucked it up. I pressed the wrong button. Um, I think that actually was going to be a perfect day, although I have another stop, so there was still another chance for me to fuck things up, but we were we were in route to a perfect day. That's okay. There was a number of screw-ups, but I kept screwing up into a shortcut that was, like, one we were going to need anyway. Also, I forgot to cover that milkshake, so it's all, it's all falling apart. Yo, Blackbird, what's up, friend? Don't look at the screen right now. Cover your eyes. I, I screwed that one up. That's okay, though. It's good to see you, Blackbird. Uh, peas and carrots. Uh, and onions. 
Beef, potatoes, and peas. Alright, so Bulgar, Cucumber Mint, and Garbanzo. Is G. Right. I knew that. I knew that. I was just testing you. Couscous. And the Spinos and Garbanzo. That should do it. A latte, mocha, vanilla, ice milk, and cover. Apples, tangerines, and that. Alright. Oh, hopefully they wanted the, the, the fried egg. They did, okay. I pressed the wrong button, but that's okay. Espresso and cover. Okay, we got there, we got there. And then with the raw egg, which is E. Right. Like I'm dancing around the T button whenever I whenever I I, I don't do the the raw egg they want they want when I do do the raw egg rather. They not want the oh. Oh, well, that's weird. I thought, I thought they wanted the the stuff, the the fancy meats. They want no meats at all. all right. Mm, they, you know they they can have it their way. Must have misread when I I thought they wanted the the garlic the garlic meats the beefs. Uh, mocha is O. Ice milk and cover. Yeah, like in this case right here, I'm dancing around the T button because I'm, I'm one fat fingering away from hacking it up right there. Oh, we need more of this stuff. I was off by one in my countings earlier. Uh, cucumber and mint. All right, tofu, yeah. And then want the raw egg. And there we go. And that was the end. Very good. Very, very good. We got a silver. Yeah, I, I got kind of close to getting a perfect day on that but i think i had three screw-ups and they were all in, like the last two not stops bad. Not bad. two two screw-ups in the last two stops not my finest performance but that's okay we got a lot of crumb coin out of it because we had some pretty quite a quite a few high high challenge high difficulty items on the menu so a couple of screw-ups can be forgiven Mouthfeel. Every time I see that. Dance Party 2008 with impatient customers. Dance Party 2008. I'm, I don't really know what to make of that. Oh, fuck. So this is going to be six points needed. Whatever we need to pick, whatever we pick, we need to be very comfortable and confident. Which means either... Wow. We really don't have any choices, do we? It, ha it has to be a three or one of the fives. Oops. Sorry. I just smacked my desk. I'll put the chicken tikka. Um, with special orders, we did fresh fish earlier. I mean, fried chicken, fried seafood, those are... And I don't know if I... Do I do I have the gamer skill to do ice cream sundaes? Ice cream sundaes are kind of tough for me. But maybe this is the maybe this is the time to learn, man. Maybe trial by fire is how we do it. Because we only have two items, so that we're still going to have a fuck ton of customers, and they're going to be very impatient, is the thing, too. But... All right, I guess the, the simplicity might... Maybe, maybe make this easier. We'll see. 40 of these things. Holy shnikes. Um, this one... Okay, I remember this. Yeah, it's one or the other. So vanilla, chalky syrup, uh, gummies, and whip. There. Praline, and chalky syrup, and strawberries. There we go. Rocky Road, and chalky syrup, and nuts, and whip. Choc and chocolate, and cookie, and whip. Alright. Rocky Road and Chalky and Nuts. Rocky Road, uh, Chalky, Hard Candy and Whip. Strawberry Gummies is G and Whip. Yeah, so it's impatient customers, not angry customers. I thought they were going to be angry. This is actually, this actually this is not quite as bad as I thought it would be. Um, however, of course, we're going to have VIP, and this is a thing. Uh, Coriander is C. Oh, they want everything. All right, cool. So now, actually, that gives us a chance to get caught up. We can get it. We can pull ahead a little bit. I have to, I have to pay a little bit close attention to the ingredients here because they don't want coriander all the time. I think coriander and turmeric are sometimes are, are a sometimes inclusion and not an always inclusion. That first page is an always inclusion though. Like they always want those. Um, 
So yeah, K, U, but in this case, uh, red chili and turmeric. So yeah, no, no coriander on that one. So I can just kind of turn my brain off and fill out that full tab, that first tab. Easy peasy. Uh, tomato base. Oh, whoops. Turmeric. Okay, that's fine. Cumin. They do want coriander. They don't want red chili that time. So yeah. So yeah, you do have to kind of pay a little bit of close attention. Cool. So that should be good. I'm actually going to keep making more because we're going to need more. There's one more stop after this. Red chili and turmeric. Keep on going, man. Keep on going. There's no downside to my knowledge, at least, of over-preparing. Over-prepping. Okay, so now, Rocky Road, and chocolate syrup, and bananas, and whip. Uh, butter, pecan, chalky, and strawberry, and whip. Rocky Road, and strawberry, and sprinkles is pee, and whip. Don't pee it. Don't, don't piss sprinkles, though. If you're pissing sprinkles, you should really consult a medical professional. Banana and whip. If your banana is pissing sprinkles, then you have, you have bigger problems on your hands. Uh, praline and chocolate syrup and nuts and whip. The nut. Strawberry and whip. Mint and chocolate and banana and whip. And uh, cookie dough is D. D's nuts, of course. Uh, coriander and turmeric, all right. Ooh, that means we have not fucked up yet. But don't you worry, the, the day is young. Actually, the day is not young because we're actually already almost done with this particular day. So I think, barring any surprises. Also, I'm not even sure we had any VIPs. I thought this was a VIP stop, but maybe it was not. Also, White Flare, good to see you, bud. Just stopping in. So that last batch will be ready soon. So this was a gold. Look at that. Our first gold for the night. Goes from terrible to good. Yeah. Yeah, I learned that as well. It's an awful world. I remember in Cooks of Delicious 2, I think, sushi was kind of tough. But in this game, yeah, I, I think I need to get more experience. Like, more practice with it. But, yeah, I think I, I found that, like, once you get the muscle movement, it's like lasagna. Once you get the muscle movement, you can bang it out pretty quick. And also, oh, you're right, though. You can upgrade to, like, more things per holding station. That's a very good point, too. Like, maybe that's where I should invest more, because I think I only have level one of that particular upgrade. I don't have any, I don't have any upgrade components right now. Oh, that was Dance Party 2008. Random foods with VIPs, of course. Can I unlock anything new? I got seven crumb coins to my name, by the way. Um, oh! Oh. Okay, then. More foods required. Random food. Press the random button. Keep pressing the button to increase the difficulty. <laughs> huh. Okay. Random. Oh, right click. Oh, there we go. Okay. And then... Okay, so three foods required. Uh, I mean, I don't want to go... Super easy. Let's do let's do one one and then one three. Then we'll do one one. And since they're VIPs, let's do one two. I I don't know, maybe should I have the anti to a three? Let's do it. Fuck it. Let's yellow it. How how bad could it be, right? It's an eight point menu. We've done worse. What's the worst that could happen, Alex says? seconds before dis disaster. You fast forward like 30 seconds and my my, my my head is on fire somehow. Actually had this on our menu not too long ago. It was not too bad. Not too bad. It's like, Alex, I left you alone. I, I alt-tab for, for like five seconds. How did you manage to light your own butthole on fire? By just playing this video game. Like, that's that's that doesn't even make sense. Doesn't even make sense, and yet, and yet, here we are. Oh man, hollow, hollow, my, my fucking nemesis. One of the hardest things that I have to deal with, it seems. Uh, pork. Uh, chicken is that one. Alright. Uh, beans and fold. Chicken and fold. 
Jackfruit is J, Mango, Ube, Krispies, and Leche. Chicken fold. Yeah, I need. I definitely need more experience with, um, with Hollow Hollow because that is something that I struggle with frequently. I'm like getting the shortcuts right, or remembering all of it. So far, we're doing okay. Tapioca is T, Ube, Rinse Juice, and Leche. Very good. Keep up the good work. Pork and beef. I think they want all of it. Need one more. Just veggie. Veggie option. And the fishies. God, and the fishies. All the cows. I don't know if Whale is listening in, but Whale appreciates a good a good cod. Hence his screen name, Whale of a Cod. J Almonds, the Jalmonds, as I call them. Tapioca Ube and the Crispy. I've mentioned before this is a really cool um it's a really, really cool uh, what's what's the uh, uh Filipino. It's a very very cool Filipino place. In St. Louis, it's, it's called uh, St. Louis Filipino uh, Bakery. Fake Filipino bread. I can't remember the exact name, but it's a. Yeah, I think it's. I think it's St. Louis Filipino bread. It's not just a bakery. They do other things, and they they do they make very good savory foods. They do really cool lunches. Gracie and I've been there a bunch of times, and it's always just d delightful. The people that run that run the restaurant are really cool. Uh, this what this a woman that works like the front counter who like she she knows our names. Like we haven't been there a ton of times. But she knows her name. She's always like super friendly. She gives free samples. She's just a sweetheart. And um, and they serve hollow hollow. And I've I've never had it, but I we've like seen people walk by with them. And every time it's like, damn man, we got to get that one these days because it looks amazing. And like just look at the all the ingredients that goes into it. And she's on top too. It's weird. But... Oh, I fucked up. <sighs> damn it, that's a shame. I actually just entered the 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 good zone, but I just screwed that one up. I put she I put the uh, mango on it without. Thought them asking for it. I'm just gonna assume that we're gonna need more of this. Oh fuck. Um, the guy fucked it up. Yeah, let's, let's try that again. Uh, beef and then onion. Maybe it's like a spinach. Okay. Wrong one. Let's do. Whoa, oh, gosh. Okay, let's get started on these. I'm falling behind a little bit. Yeah, mango. There it is. Crispies. Oh, it's the ma that's what got me last time. It's the maca balls. I saw the letter C in in maca balls and I got excited. That's what did it, man. That's what did it. it happens to the best of us. Oh, wrong button. Crap. I did not mean to press that one. Uh, does that do it? No, that was wrong. That was wrong. Banana. Ube and Krispies. Um, Ube and then Garbanz was G. Red mango. Red mango. That's so weird. Jeez, there it is. Uh, flatten and then chicken and fold. Fold. All right, let's make some more of the fishies. Gonna need more. Beans and fold. The rest should just be the fishies, actually. Let's make more of these. Dunk that shit. Dunk a chino. So we got a silver for sure. I mean, we had a couple, couple goops, but we're okay. What are you gonna do? Stab me? Yes, followed shortly by an, a horrible stab wound. Is there a comfy doggy behind me? There is. He's a sleepy boy. He's out cold. Absolutely out cold. Think really hard, carefully, and deeply, and then just don't think. Well, I think you're right. You almost kind of have to go into the Zen mode and just you did your best, let then. muscle memory that and. The top of your brain take over, Good job, chef. We'll get but just the top of your brain. Like if there's a way to shut off the rest of your brain, so that way, like you could be, like you said, like you're like hyper focused and you're in the zone. But getting into that zone is the hard thing, and that probably just comes from experience and just time with the game. I would say I feel like I have moments like that, but then they are at times fleeting. But yeah, cheese and ice cream. It's not like cheese sauce or like a slab of cheese, but like little cheese shavings. I don't know. 
I don't know. I mean, I, um, I'm not a huge fan of cheese, but also I'm lactose intolerant, so I would not be able to, to enjoy ube ube or a hollow hollow anyway, unless it was with like, you know, lactose free ice cream. The king potato is just staring me in the face and to make matters worse, I see that VIP fella staring me down. Now, granted, King Potato would not be a holding st well, it's a holding station food, so it would only be in the holding station section, but still, King Potato scares me. Nine foods required. Three stops, too. Yeah, three stops. Not a, not a huge one, but it's huge enough, that's what she said. Um, I feel like I need a good good with souffle. I don't really like souffle in this game. The timing fucks me up real good. Real bad and real good. But I gotta I gotta get good. Let's do soda floats. I think I have no choice. I think I have to do everything. Yeah, we have to do so it's cute that it gives you a menu of options. It's cute that the game's like, pick from these things. Actually, we lied. You have to do all of them. Get good scrub. So potato is f I mean that oh man like I said maybe I just gotta get good let's let's go a little easy on ourselves let's do have let's have grilled cheese on here we need to overcomplicate things since we're we are being forced into a corner with this menu real good and real bad but also real good sometimes you know sometimes it's good to get fucked up a little a little a little good a little bad a little good sometimes it's what the body needs All right, let's get moving. sometimes it's what we crave Except in my case, when it comes to my lactose intolerance, it fucks me up, and it's not an, an enjoyable fucking up. It's like it's a I need to use the restroom, and now I am sad. Big potatoes, and one more, bam. And then, man, this is quite the bevy of options. Classic, bam. All right, so. Pissed batter. Yes, I'd like to get pissed, please. And then vanilla batter. Am I right? So cinnamon powder. Bam. What? Oh, it was probably I, not C. C was something else. Off to a great start, by the way. Uh, broccoli and sour cream. Cheese. Chives is I. Jalapenos bacon. Oh, that's cool. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh, chocolate powder. That's what it was. It was chocolate powder. Not cinnamon powder. That's where I fucked up. Uh, pistachio, bam. Brownies went bad instantly. No surprise there. Cinnamon powder is I. It is N. It is N. All right, ice cream, bam. Uh, cr oh, I don't know what that is. Crap. Uh, oh Jesus. Oh, I think I think I did that okay. Um, oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Yeah, I, I, I shouldn't have entered this menu. That was a, that was a mistake. Not so good. Oh, they don't want broccoli on that. What am I doing? Butter, beef, sour cream, cheese, chili, chives. Uh, all right, cool. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 I knew this was going to be a disaster, and yet I still put myself through it because I don't make good decisions. And I feel like I just got to get good, man. I also really need to learn these shortcuts, because these shortcuts really fuck me up. Cinnamon powder versus chocolate powder. That's what it was. Yeah, I saw the C powder and my brain that's just right. fucking autocorrected, oh and that's exactly why. No wonder. Alright, so yeah, it's like that's the kind of thing you have to really, really pay attention to. Like, real close attention. Oops. And then, um... Stuff. Gonna need more where that came from. Raspberry. We're probably still okay, though. Bit of a rough start, but we can turn it. We can turn the beat around. Uh, cinnamon powder is in. The there it stop. is. We got there. We got there. Raspberry batter. Bam. Coffee batter is C, I'm guessing. F. F to pay respects. Cinnamon powder and cool. Uh, all of my tates, all of my potates are dead. Not anymore. Those are going there. Chocolate powder is C. There we go. See, I'm learning. 
Can you believe it? You can teach an old hobbit new tricks. Uh, get some pretzels up in this bitch. And also some... Oh, I need to... Oh, the potatoes are almost ready. Oh boy. That's real fast. I don't like that. Don't like that at all. Uh, ham. Alright, cool. Oh, crap. I fucked that up anyway. Um, get this one. Crap. Yeah, they're dropping like flies. No surprise there. I still need one more. Uh, see. Okay, not great. Not great. I think we're still in silver territory. More or less. But it's still, it's still spicy. Actually, this is a good time for me to get caught up on things. More brownies, more of this thing. Oh, crap, I shouldn't have started this. Okay. Oh, B. R is broccoli, not B. Dang it. I think that got me earlier, too. So, brownies, we'll actually need more for that. Pot We're gonna have a lot of potatoes. This is gonna be a rough final stop, man. I can tell already. Pretzel. Oh, wrong button. Pretzels. And I think the rest we'll have to deal with as as it comes up. Ooh boy, cheesy batter is C. I'm gonna wait a little bit on the timing for these because this could be really awful. Chocolate is H. Vanilla is V. So pow power sugar. Powdered sugar is S. Cinnamon powder is N. Butterscotch is probably B. Yes, it is B. Out of brownies. Tail is all this time. Uh, cinnamon powder. What? Did I not start brownies? There we go. What the fuck did I do wrong? Uh, powdered sugar. Oh, I think I pressed this too early. Powdered sugar is S. Yeah, I, I pressed it too early. That's pretty bad. I pressed the wrong button. Pistachio. Bam. Pistachio so they don't get pissed. Um, not play this much. Oh my god. Okay, we'll have to let those drop. Uh, syrup. Cool. And then powder. Raspberry. And then vanilla. Oh, crap. Order up. Raspberry. Ice cream. Um. Oh, I know what the problem is. Let's do... Can I get this in time? No, I cannot. Oh god, it's all falling apart. I might have to repeat this day. Actually... Yeah, I don't like that noise. Out of brownies, out of a lot of things. Oh wow, yeah, every everything just expired on us. I need more of that stuff. Okay. So cinnamon cinnamon batter is in. Some metal fix going in here. We might have we might still be able to get a a bronze. We'll see though. Oh god, what am I out of? I don't know what I'm out of. Um, nine is powdered sugar. Um, oh, I'm out of potatoes for one thing. Uh, this one. There we go. Chocolate batter. Yeah, this this was this was a mistake. <laughs> this was a mistake because I uh, I put together a menu that was way too difficult. I I mean I knew it was gonna be hard, but yeah, it's I I just gotta get good, man. I mean the only way you get good is by struggling in this game, <laughs> or just doing lots and lots of practice. But I don't know, we'll see how we did in the, in the overall score. Understand food well enough to shortcut it. Yeah, which I which I don't, and I mean. I guess I need to like maybe do more practice off screen, off stream rather, because I only play this on stream. Hey, we got Wired Wolf. Thank you, Saris Messenger, for joining in as well. Good to see you, uh, Saris. Hope you're doing well. I get a Wired Wolf for that. Let's do a quick shout out for our friend. What's up, Jet? Good to see you, buddy. Not, not Weird Wolf. Wired Wolf. There we go. There we go. I can spell your name right. How's Deus Ex going for you, by the way, dude? You just missed a very. Less than savory performance on my end. As you can see, there was a lot of screw-ups. We had some really hard things in the menu. But I, uh, yeah, I need to... 
I mean, the, the only the only way you get good at this game is by exposing yourself to the really really hard menu items, by like you know playing playing with them and doing practice runs with them. And um, I played with a really a bunch of hard menu items and I got my my little booty kicked. But that is just that's how that is one way of learning. Impatient customers and minimum. Uh, oh right, the 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 the, the prep stations that kind of thing. Yeah, I think I saw on the Discord server, you said you were starting up a new playthrough of Deus Ex. And of course, it's a classic, yeah. Getting going for the augments. Running around like Gordon Freeman. I, I've actually never beaten Deus Ex. I've, I played it a little bit, but I didn't get terribly far. Uh, on like one or on like two occasions, I think. But in both times, I set it aside, meant to go back to it, and never came back to it. I, it's like, it's one of those FPSs that, like classic FPSs that I, I always mean to get back to, but... One of these days. One of these days, I'm actually going to do it. Uh, we can afford creme brulee, by the way. I'm going to do it. But I'm also going to practice it, because I have no idea what I'm getting myself into. Let's do a quick practice run. This is Cooks of Delicious 3, by the way. This is a pretty cool uh, little game, where, as you can see, it's like a cooking game, or, or a food service game. You take custom orders. You serve it to people. In this case, it's in a food truck. Let's see what creme brulee is all about. So, Torch, you hold the button down. Um, how do I know when it's done? Perfectly brown. Uh, is that perfectly brown? No, it is not. Okay, that's not it. Okay, that's not it either. Is that it? Damn. It's- oh, I need- I need to do the next preps. It's a good thing I'm practicing. I need to know what perfectly golden brown looks like. This one is- I don't know if I'm gonna bust this one out too often. Don't burn it. And then, yeah. That's probably it. Okay. So it's, it is really a timing thing. Once it hits that third phase, that's when you're, that's when you know you're set. But that's going to be, that's going to be tough. I'm going to, I'm going to go easy on, on myself as much as I can at least. Uh, with other things, with because that's the hardest one for that one at least. It can be a bit of a slog, yeah. It's it's not that I like wasn't enjoying myself. It's just that other games got in the way, and and yeah, I just I never got around to it. But yeah, there's the original, of course. There's uh, Invisible War, which I know not everybody loved, but was apparently still a pretty cool game. Then there's the reboot games, which are I've heard pretty pretty good. So lots of good stuff though. Inventory management survival. <laughs> I mean, there is a dystopia, there's like the dystopian aspect where it's, you're, you're kind of in a, um, in a post-apocalyptic world. So the survival horror aspect of it is kind of on the nose, at least in some ways. Let's do ice cream scoops. We've done a lot of frozen lattes today. I I'm trying to like force myself to do variety. Let's do, let's do milkshakes against my better judgment. And we'll do this one. Yeah, like I said, I'm just going to go easy on myself. As we've, we've made a bit of a tough menu for ourselves, but, you know, sometimes the way to personal growth is to stretch yourself outside your comfort zone. So, that is how these things go. All right, let's get moving. Let's get moving, indeed. I'm a little bit nervous about that creme brulee. Oops, I fucked it up already. Off to a good start. There we go. Takes a oh, 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 not that. Oh. Alright, sure. I just want to cancel that out. So I can do this. Actually, I lied. We actually do need more frozen bananas. And then, what is Puffo? I've never heard of Puffo, but it sounds wild and it's blue as hell. That's cool as hell. Uh, cookie bits. It's K. Hard candy. Marshmallows. Vanilla. Oh god. Here we go. Right, cool. Alright, not too bad, not too bad. I think I did drop a couple orders there, so kind of a rough start. Uh, salmon is S. But I think we're gonna be okay. I think, I think now we've got some momentum behind us. White Flare says, stretching outside your comfort zone, Alex. Don't threaten me with a good time. White Flare says... White Flare knows that I have a tendency to very much embrace things getting weird here. So White Flare, you're, you're correct. 
to go out of your way to to introduce some some shenanigans because you know I, I respond well to it. Although it's kind of on me for using the phrase stretching yourself out. There's an instance, uh, this was like probably a year or so. Oh, I, I pressed the wrong fucking fish. Probably like a year or so ago, Gracie went to a, um, was it a chiropractor? I think it was a chiropractor. And um, I asked how it went and she was like, it went pretty well. It's always nice to get We're stretched out. There. And then she was like, that's what she said. And I was like, damn, she got my ass. She got my ass with a real good, that's what she said. Dip and then the double mint. Cookies and cream. Always good to get stretched out. That's what she said. Cook some green there. One, two, three. There we go. We got the timing down pretty good. So, you know what? Look at that. Look, let's, look at us just knocking shit down like a boss. Uh, Rocky Road and Cookie Dough. Yeah, so we're not getting a perfect score. The way we're going. Well, we can't because we already fucked up. But we are... We're, we're going to get a solid silver. A silver plus, we'll call it. gonna need more of many of those things in a minute. That's okay. Albacore. Strawberries and vanilla and cover. Oh, I forgot to cover the milkshake earlier. That's what, that was one screw up earlier. That's quite the word. Z what's that word? Z Zabione? Zabion? Shock and overload right there. I can I can't get down for it. Oh, we need more of this stuff. We need a second batch, actually. And that'll do it. That will do it. Never had creme brulee. I've had creme brulee once in my life, and it was nice. It's very rich and like pretty decadent. And I think it's also like kind of expensive. It's not like an everyday occasion kind of thing. Um, I liked it though. I liked it. I can't. It, this was years and years ago, so I can't remember much about it. But I remember liking it and it, it being kind of, kind of unique, kind of weird, and kind of different. Not bad. Um, like you know the, the the melted sugary batter stuff, kind of on the top layer, really it, it does kind of give it a kind of a unique consistency. White Flur says, "Team weird as you should be." And then I smiled, but you're damn right I did, Jade. Yeah, you're damn right I did. My wife making a, that's what she said, joke. That means I have corrupted her properly. Watch this game is making, yeah, dude, that's how this game goes. I, I always give, the, I, I try to give the warning where it's like if you're trying to practice intermittent, intermittent fasting and you are watching or playing this game, it will make you hungry. That's why I, incl I include the tags hungry, hangry, and horngry in the in the tag uh, system whenever I stream this game magnetic flash drive right yeah 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 like a recovery image stuck to the case interesting yeah I mean huh that is, is kind of interesting I mean I guess that is nice although if, if like the drive is stolen or something then that could be perhaps a little bit tricky unless it was like encrypted with like a key that you knew or something this is watching calories literally says Jade in the strictest of definition of watching calories. Watching them as they go into my mouth when I eat them. Yes. Yeah, exactly. Don't put magnets in your computer. Yeah, exactly. Computers are magnetic, yeah. Yeah, because the magnetic tape, obviously. Right. But yeah, since it's a flash drive, it, that would be with flash memory. So yeah, there's no tape involved. It is kind of weird, isn't it? Yeah. Because yeah, I, I think flash memory wouldn't give a shit when it comes to magnets. Magnets, how do they work? Seven foods required. I do have quite a few crumb coins in my name. We could buy uh, one of these two things, but not both. We already have sub sandwiches. You guys have an opinion on tofu of the Japanese variety? Um, hiyo, hiyo yaka tofu, hiyo yaka, or omelets. Omelets are a little bit tougher. Magnets are magic. I think you're right, White Flare. I think you're correct, my friend. I'm kind of feeling the, the omelet, actually. I'm kind of feeling the omelet. My, myself. Meself. Nothing against the tofu enjoyers, but... Let's give the omelet a quick little practice. Egg, ham, cheese, bacon. 
Egg, mozz, cheese, bacon, tomato, onions, oh boy, sausage, spinach. Some of these are pretty involved. I'm guessing we'll have to fold them too, right? Some kind of final step. Oh, there is not a final step. Wow, it really is just slap shit together and you're good to go. It's actually not too bad. I was thinking there's gonna be like a multiple step phase. G R Y S. That's my kind of that's my kind of uh, omelet right there. Lots and lots of, of diced peppers and such. Sausage and spinach. Do a few more. Cheese. G R Y S. S. Yeah, the, the garden garden uh, omelet. Mushroom is M. Spinach. Not too bad. All right, I think we we get the gist. That's actually not too shabby. Bloodlines, um, bloodlines. You're referring to Castle? V oh wait, no, hold on. You're not talking about Castlevania. Bloodlines. Crap. I'll confess. I think I might not know you're referring to. Blood, an RPG named Bloodlines. When I think Bloodlines, I think uh, Castlevania. But I don't know if that's what you're getting at. Oh. VTM. Oh, Vampire the Masquerade. Oh, okay. The fact that I didn't know what the acronym was from the get-go probably informs you that I don't know uh, much about Vampire the Masquerade, so probably not anytime soon. Because, yeah, that's the... Is Bloodlines the new one, or is that the old one? Because I'm kind of maybe a little bit curious about the old one. Like, the one that's super weird. I mean, they're all... I guess they're all kind of weird, but, like, apparently the old one is, like... Uh, very well known for being quite the oddity. Like, weird dialogue, weird NPC directions. It's very cryptic. Bloodlines 2, gotcha. Okay, so yeah, so Bloodlines is the original one. World of Darkness, yeah. I, th I think you're probably White Werewolf. I think I would like it. Because you know I love games like Morrowind. I love, uh, I love old jank. And the original, uh... Vampire the Masquerade game that I've of which I've seen footage seems like it has a lot of jank and I mean that not in a negative sense I mean I kind of I kind of like that in older games like that older PC games it is it is a vibe that I do respond well to so yeah it's something I I, I think I'd, I would like to try my hand at at some point I, I kind of have a, a kind of a general list of things of games I kind of have planned Kind of, sort of, like, kind of a loose list in my mind of things I want to play in the near future. So I, I can't guarantee I'll, that it'll happen, you know, particularly soon. But yeah, something like that I think would be kind of fun to play. And by something like that, I mean that exact game would be kind of fun to play. At some point in my future. This game will likely take another couple weeks, probably. This game's pretty long. I mean, I'm not going to do a 100% playthrough, obviously. I'm, I don't really have the, the skill set to, uh, to to commit to a full playthrough. I'd have to I'd have to be playing off stream, and I don't think I have that kind of um, that kind of dedication. Whoopsie daisy. Try that again. There we go. One more. There we go. We're going to need more of all these things. And ham, cheese, bacon. Off to a pretty good start, honestly. Wine, muscles, and wood. I remember the time I forgot the li I forgot the muscles on one of those orders, and I felt so bad. It was none too happy. The customer is like, uh, "There's something missing here, and I'm a little bit upset." Cheese, gr wine, spinach, red sauce, muscles, and lid. enough of everything. We'll need some more strippies. Some more chimkins. I like that noise. Do I need... I think we'll rob... Oh, it's just for this last one. That's not too bad. Refer to the old one, yeah. It would be on me. Yeah, I, I think you're right. I think you're both right. I think it would be pretty cool. I've never played a tabletop game with the World of Darkness system, but I have a number of friends that have, and they love it. If there's ever, like, a conversation around unsung and underappreciated tabletop role-playing game systems, uh, they will find a way to shoehorn 
World of Darkness into the conversation. And I and I don't mean that despairingly. I mean, they, they really do think it's very good. And I believe them. I think it is probably very good. It's just something I've never had a chance to experience yet. But um, it'd be cool to, to play like a tabletop game with it. And it'd be cool to play the video game for that matter. Because, I mean, I played a lot of a game called... Um, almost said almost said Cooks and Doors. I played a lot of a game called... Um, Secret World Legends, which has what I would consider to be some overlap, not so much in like the like the like the gameplay necessarily, because I don't really know much about the gameplay, but just kind of in the way the story is told in that game, and just like the the writing style, at least from what I've seen, what little I've seen of the game. I think I've played games that are similar enough to it, and even and again I, I name dropped Morrowind. I mean Morrowind is a game that is. Where, that, where you have to relish the jank, because if you do not relish the jank, you'll you'll hate yourself and the game by the end of it. So, so yeah, I, I would never say never. Actually, I think that should be the last one, actually. Plays entirely different. Good. Um, Pathologic. That was the other one. It reminds me of Pathologic, and which I have played through. And I liked Pathologic a lot. Gold menu, by the way, or gold medal, by the way. Pathologic, I like a lot. That's a fucking hard game to play and is hey, brutal wow. in its uh, unforgivingness, but I found it to be way. very enjoyable, Maybe and it's not for everyone. So, yeah. Wonderful work, Enjoying Pathologic and Morrowind and Secret World Legends makes me think I would probably like the old-school Bloodlines game. A secret world of- ooh, name drop. Undead creatures, right, conspiracies. That's exactly what Secret World Legends is based on. Like, or the, the basic story, at least. So, yeah, there could be coded messages. All too familiar, yeah. So I, I think I would enjoy that. They're chill despite. Well, thank you, Shane. I I appreciate that. You know me. I I try to keep the 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 uh, the commentary going. I try to I try to have thoughts and I try to form them and I try to do them correctly, form them correctly and use my mouth to speak them out loud. They don't always work. <laughs> Sometimes I fuck up a little bit, but uh, but I, I appreciate that. I, can, I I think you can tell I'm trying, so I, I appreciate your your kind words. Mentioned blow lights. Oh, there you go, White Flare. I am sorry that you're feeling sick, though, bud. That's no good, White Flare. If you do have to get to bed, I totally get it. But, um, of course, I, of course, I'm happy to have you here. But, yeah, I, dude, I was, you probably know, I was sick with COVID two and a half weeks ago, and that shit was not a fun time. And there were, there was like, especially the first day or two, all I could do was just like, like, I, I wasn't comfortable enough to, I couldn't like get comfortable to sleep. So I would just sit at my desk like this and just be like this. Just, just miserable. Just fucking miserable. It sucks, man. You played Vampire Tabletop? Yeah. It seems... It does seem pretty sweet, honestly. It's a unique setting, yeah. Which is good. Which is good, yeah. No Country for Old Men. <laughs> directed by Suda51. That's pretty fucking weird, and I'm kind of down, honestly. Buying it from it. You know, I, I might have it on Steam already. I very well might. But like I said, I don't wanna <laughs> I don't wanna get, you know, hopes up for any time soon at least. Cause I mean it's definitely a game I would I think I would like to play. But I kinda already have kind of a list of games that I want I'm gonna play in the near future. So I, I don't wanna, you know, mislead anybody in thinking that I'm gonna get to it immediately. But it, it's a game that is very much on the list. Very much on the list for sure. But, um, and especially this game, like I was saying, this game is going to take a while to complete. Probably another few weeks, I'm guessing. Oh, it's another random one, by the way. Just because, yeah, like the bloodlines, uh, just the lore. Because, yeah, there's, my understanding is that the lore goes quite deep. Um, I'd be curious how, how 2 will shake out. Um, because I'd imagine it's one of those games where, one, it was a cult classic, and two, I haven't seen much of the gameplay, but it looks like it should be, like, fairly modern. And I could see that maybe rubbing some people the wrong way. Should I do a four? I don't know. What are these? These are holding this. Let's do. Let's do one four holding station. Let's do that. That way we're keeping it spicy and sexy. There's an unofficial fan patch as well. Oh, right. Because <laughs> it's an old PC game and getting it to run on Windows right. 10 slash 11 might be a bit of a mess. Which is how it goes with that old school jank. The aforementioned old school jank, like I was just saying. Also, we rolled into uh, Pizza by the Slice. Not, not too bad, not too bad. Parmesan, olives, spinach, is S, it is green peppers. Book of Eden, which I think 
just gets everything? I don't know if it gets everything all the time. Um, shh, what is this one? Just the lemon grass, cool. And then potatoes and dunk. And potato and dunk. And pizza. And that's awfully easy. So easy that I don't trust. Let's make another pizza. And toss. Alfredo, cheese, pep, good beef, and chick chickens. And then let's make let's make one of each thing. Chicken, bacon, carrots, and garlic. Uh, tamarind and red. Better red than I dead. Knew you could do it. That was amazing. Lemongrass. And no chives in this one. Can I make another? Nah, it's fine. Tandoori, dunk it. Tandoori, dunk it. And rice, dunk that shit. The shit has been dunked. Don't actually... All, the shit has been dunked, although I don't think I would recommend having a, sh a shit samosa. Breaded shit dunked in, in oil. Would not be a good time. Uh, mint flakes, onions, shrimp, and tomatoes. And mix. Mix that shit. Alright, uh, red and white. I do that right? And dates. And the white again, yes. Green. Nice, dunk it. Eight, rice it. And dunk it, right. So, avocados, V, uh, j j peppers, uh, shrimp, tomatoes, and mix. Yeah, five stops, and I'm gonna make my pizza. Oh shit, I should have started this. Jeez. Good beef, parmesan, chicken, all those green peppers, red peppers. Cool. Red and uh, red. That's awfully easy. Oh, they didn't want carrots. Try that again. Almost there. And bacon, carrots, garlic. Potato. Potato, mint is I G H T mix. Don't forget to mix it. A sweet potato is S. That's an easy thing to miss. It's ready. So I'm going to do another one of these. I'm gonna do another one of these. Dates. I think we've had yeah, this is a perfect day so far. Four out of five stops in. Another pizza stuffed crust. Okay, so cheese, sausage, parmesan is R, onions, spinach is S, it is diced tomatoes, hell yeah. Potatoes and don't get. Uh, mint flakes is on. I don't like that sound. Are they gonna reroute us? Um, holding station. Except it did not work, right? Yeah, yeah. No, we're good. We're good. It, they would have. They tried to break our holding stations, but they didn't fucking do it. Also, I think I gave them the wrong sauce. I think I just. Oh, they cleared out my holding stations. Wow, that's mean. I get it. I was like, it, it said holding stations destroyed. I was like, no, it's fine. We, they can't destroy it. Now I see, yeah. Hammer end. Uh, celery. Oh no! Um, chives and low. Yeah, so there goes our perfect day. Fuck, I was doing so well too. That's okay. I should have pay been paying more attention. That's a new kind of attack. One that we are not. I was not ready for. Red cheese, pep sausage. That's bacon. That's meat lovers right there. Unfortunate, unfortunate, but that's just how it goes, man. I can placate myself by reminding myself that golds are I mean they're nice, but they're not required. They're not required for progress, but they are they are nice. They are nice. Bug fixes only. Because there's- oh, it adds some unfinished content, which could be kind of cool, but for a- maybe for a, play, a first playthrough might not be recommended necessarily. I know Stalker has some similar stuff where there's a fuck tons- the Stalker series that is- has a fuck tons of mods, which are great. And some mods add in some- uh, some of the- like, the cut content and whatnot, which is neat. Or like- or like fan- uh, like cut content that was like, then finished or attempted to be finished by the fans. Which is neat, but uh, but yeah, it, it for again for a first plate there might be a bit much. Celery, uh, mint flakes, on ocean mix. Right, cool.
Alright, and then meat. And then sweet potato. Cheese. Tandoori. And then the rest should be taken care of, right? Well, I invested a lot of time getting the holding station stuff set. Uh, dates. Yes. Tandoori. We got back to perfect status. Just in time for the end. That's okay. Silver. We'll take the silver medal. Garden of Eden to modern times. So it covers a lot of, of lore. Then that's a, that's a lot of storytelling, man. Holy shit. Not There's bad. always rules for it. Good to know. Good, thank Not you. Bad. Thank you again to Whiteflare for stopping in and for hitting us with some sick knowledge, man. That's some good stuff. <laughs> Look at that, man. The one dropped order. The one dropped order. But that's okay. Like I said. Like I said, lessons were learned. And now I know what that particular attack style looks like. Let's just skip the worst part. That's good. If you if you really think it is worth skipping, yeah. And so there's a sewer section. Some yeah, some older games, when they've got a sewer section, it's it can be a fuck fest. And not even the good kind of fuck fest. Some raw sweet peppers with hot sauce. I mean that would be well, that, that definitely sounds like a fairly low impact snack. I hope it I hope it tastes okay. I think I actually I like raw peppers in things, but I've never just like just eaten a raw pepper. Also, do do dad, good to see you, bud. Cook, serve, eat. That's that's the IRL version of cook, serve, delicious, or cook, eat, delicious. Another random food setup. Need 14 points. We'll do something simple. We'll do a single four tier for this guy, and then all two. So let's do one. Three. Let's mix it up. Make it a little bit spicy for ourselves. Just a little spicy. It's not too bad. Good for watching count. Yeah, I mean that makes sense. If you want something to something that's low impact, if you're feeling hungry but you don't want you don't want it to keep you up super late, and you don't want it to uh, ooh, banana cream, very nice. Don't want it to uh, yeah to 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 ruin the, the, you know, to mess up the progress you've been doing on, you've been doing good on, then, yeah, I totally, totally get that. That's very respectable. Respectable one to stick to it. Uh, mussels, squid, red jalapenos, oh, that's, that's everything. Everything on it. Alright, those are coming in hot. Bam. The burgers are next. Meat, meat, lettuce, tomatoes, pickles, fried egg, which is E, and then regular bun. Cool. Meat, 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 bacon, cheese, cheese, Swiss, regular. Pretty good start. Love, you work, love the way you work it. Uh, be the chakalaka. Oh, what are they gonna do now? They're gonna, they're gonna piss in my cereal again. Well, except my shit is literally bulletproof, so. Short of a ten pack. Miss me with that bullshit. Poor guy. Fucked that up last time. More meats. And we're gonna need one more chakalaka. Whoops. Hold on. Cabbage. Beans. I mean, you know. Oh, there we go. Yeah, we're good. We're good. It's about our calamari, mussels, squid, jalapenos. They want everything. The whole gambit. Lobsters. Scallions, but no shrimp on that one. That's good. They want everything on that one. Scallions, that one. All right. Um, better. Where's good? No problem, chef. That's, oh, I pressed the wrong button. Whoops. Yeah, so I dropped a couple things. That's okay, though. That's okay. Yeah, I dropped a couple orders, but that's okay. We're, we're still very much in the safety zone, I think, so we should be okay. Lots of bergs, though. Wowzers. So many burgers, so little time. Oh, whoops. Mm. 
just gonna go ahead and make these myself on a per order basis. Although we're gonna need more anyway, so I might as well. We have three more stops after this. We got our work cut out for us. Each and covered. Boop. Might as well take this as an opportunity. They don't want carrots in that one. I screwed it up. Gonna need more. Actually, we might have just enough. Next stop approaching. King Lobster. King Lobster. Yeah, I screwed up the lobster earlier because I clicked the button way too early and they were very upset at me. Very upsetty. get very involved like some of these some of these burgers are extremely complicated it's like holy shit calm down calm down with those burgs garlic sauce is a g that's where that's what we are we are a g blueberry uh l and then lattice so many meats it's a little time we have just enough meats no more no less Lobster. Uh, all right, we're all right, we're all right. We're hanging in there. We're holding it together. Trying to, trying to hold it down, man. Really standard burgers, just like meat, lettuce, onions, tomato, like really, really chip simple. And then these, which have everything under the sun. So cheesy. Ginger sauce is oh, it's, that's G is garlic. I think it's I for ginger. I think I, I think that's got me in the past too. Oh fuck. And covered. Ooh, lots of this stuff. Uh, beans, tomatoes. I need to make uh, one more of those, actually. Okay. Oh, so many meats. Oh my god, we got a bajillion burgers in this order. I'm not looking forward to this. So many meats. Oh boy, this is gonna be a stop. This is gonna be the last one, too. Last one for this day. Not like IRL day, but. Although I will need to wrap up probably a little bit. Oh fuck, wrong button. Shit. This might have to. I might have to settle for a bronze on this one. This is not my finest Second performance. I was about to say, why did I pick this like odd combination of things? Oops, sorry, my mic didn't mean to hit my microphone. Why did I hit this, uh, choose this odd combination of foods? And I remembered, oh right, this was chosen for me. Because this was, a, it needed to be an all random menu, so that explains it. It's like, man, why did I choose this? All right, I didn't choose it. It's chosen for me. Yeah, sorry for smacking my microphone there. If I didn't mean to punch you in the ear just now. I, usually I try to avoid abusing my audience if I have given the choice. Given the option. Uh, I did that last time too. Crap. Thank yeah, wrong kind of cheese. So many onions. I'm not judging. I actually love onions on burgers, so I love it. Totally get it. Oh, wrong button. That's okay. Okay, so maybe we still scrap by with the silver. We'll see. Ah, oh, heck. Probably only barely.
Well, this is what Mario Kart was meant to be, slapping orders together and throwing them at customers. Look at that. I, I think that last one screwed me because I think you have to have less than eight total fuck-ups for it to be a silver, so... Ah, whatever, man, whatever. Burger Time. There's actually a game called Burger Time, I think. Like an old-school arcade game. Pizza Time because of Pizza Tower. Yeah, before, we, when you heard Pizza Time, you would think Spider-Man. Now, when you hear Pizza Time... You think Pizza Tower, which looks like a really fuck, like really fucking incredible game. I want to pick it up at some point because it looks very fun and just very zany. This game needs it. Yeah, there, there have been so many times where I feel like I've had a bubble bass moment where I like I forget like I I, I screw up one shortcut frequently. Because the problem that I sometimes have with this game is that avocado is a good example of this. Sometimes the shortcut for av avocado is V. Sometimes the shortcut for avocado is A. Well, use that's not a problem, but what if you have olives that are also um, an, uh, an entry? Olives can be the letter O, or they can be the letter V. So it's either V for avocado or V for olive. What about the letter O? That could be pork, that could be potato. So it's real easy to accidentally fat finger or just, or just press the wrong button when you're trying to go fast given like depending on what you're making and you just have to try to keep it straight in your mind just because there aren't enough letters on the keyboard or letters in the alphabet for everything and uh, yeah it, get, it gets tough it gets really tough and yeah there have been mo so many moments where i've like i'm like oh my god I, i'm having a bubble bass moment like i keep forgetting this one thing okay so on the nachos instead of nacho cheese you know what i always assumed nacho cheese and queso were interchangeable like i thought they were the same thing but maybe i'm wrong actually 10,000 calorie Mega Whopper from Ion. Oh, they, there's like a Giganto burger in Ion Fury. I've never played that one, but I, um, I've i seen some gameplay of it. It looks pretty sick. The squid. Oh my god. Oh, what's up, Farsight? The Squidward Wiggle Dance. Um, I think I. I mean, I know like a few of the images. Is that the one where he's like. Yeah, maybe send me a, a video of Farsight so I can properly recreate this. Wario Land and Sonic, yeah. I mean, that's the thing. I, I love Wario Land and I love Sonic, so it looks fucking great. They're quite different. Interesting. My lactose intolerant ass does not know the difference, honestly. Gives you 25 HP. Sounds like in real life, it would remove HP. It would make me shit myself to death, probably. Taking a right downtown. All right, you got a far side. Yeah, let's go and do that. Uh, let me let me do this real quick. Let's go ahead and set the menu. Eight foods required. I'm not gonna go super easy on myself. I could just set all zeros, and it'd be Gucci. I'm gonna do. Let's do all twos. You know what? Let's do. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna do a couple ones. But I'm also gonna do a three down here and a four up here. What's that sound? I don't want these things to reproduce, Jade. Too late. Too late. It's happening. The reproduction is happening. There's nothing you can do to stop it. They're beautiful in their own way. Beauty is subjective, all right? Beauty is in the eye of the beholder, and that includes the extremely elongated eye. The elongated eyes of the creation we just birthed. I can place my water here without fear of knocking it over. Hello, chef. Good luck today. Thanks, Whisk. Or Cleaver? No, you're probably Whisk, because you're all nice and cheerful. If you were Cleaver, you would be like, All right, Chef, go fucking decapitate some motherfuckers tonight. And then I would feel awkward, but then I would also have a boner. So, can't have one without the other. Pancakes! Speaking of boners, pancakes, hell yeah. Pancakes and pork loins, now it's a party. Hell to the yes. Hell to the yes. Oh, I didn't- I clicked that too prematurely. Sometimes we click our buttons prematurely. It's nothing to be ashamed of. It happens. It's a strawberries. All right, queso and then chicken and beef. Wow, that was super easy. I like it. I like it so much. We're gonna do some tiramisu. We have eight stops with this menu, by the way. Holy schnikes! Eight goddamn stops. Can you believe it? Won't you believe it? So it's gonna be a thick stop, I can tell already. Thick one. Thick one while he's away. A mushroom and fennel. And then this old thing, this old chestnut. Fold. My money don't jiggle jiggle, it folds. Much like my pupasas. 
Kupasas don't jiggle, jiggle, they fold. Nope, and... Oh, that was matcha. Yeah, matcha is, is like the same thing as, as milk, honestly. Boobas, ice, and matcha, and seal. Yep, definitely boobas, it's not bobas. I refuse to, he refuse to hear anything otherwise. Spinach and pesto, wrap seasoning, cool. Cold. Okay, so chicken and shrimp and beef and meats. Okay, so olives, chicken, beef, sour cream, and guac. You got it, fam. Okay, so tomatoes, chicken, sour cream. Oh, that was guacamole, not sour cream. Oh, gosh. They hate me. Chicken, shrimp, beef, meats. So, chicken, shrimp, beef, meats. Blueberries and strawberries and that thing. And, uh-oh, that, that noise means we got some fancy beeps coming in. They think they're so cool. Beef. Oh, my God. Uh, rice olives, black beans. Uh, that's just everything. Everything. And I still fucked it up. So, rice, onions, tomatoes, shrimp, uh, sour cream, rock. Okay, so, yeah, thank you for being merciful. Holy shit. I still fucked up on that one somehow. Not sure what I did wrong in there, but I did something wrong. Luck. Goat. Chicken fold. Oh, besides, and then Thai is T? It is not. Where's Thai? Thai is H? It's H. Tomatoes, chicken, sour cream. That is guacamole, not sour cream. God damn it. That's, that happened earlier. Oh gosh. Okay, so refried beans, wheat, and guac. There we go. Okay, that was a little bit rough, but we got there. That we knew that was gonna be a rough one. And it was, it was, but we, we made it. Scrounged it, scrounged through. Oh, my one. Lots of pancakes. Need more. Need more pancakes. In my life, in my mouth, please. Please and thank you. Cranberry and rose. There it is. Beans and fold. Cheese and fold. What was ice? Jasmine is gonna be J? Yes. Okay, no, it's gonna be O? Yes. O? Yes. Okay, so chicken, shrimp, beef, meat. Just sour cream, okay, so no guac. That's the secret. Secret unlocked. And meat is M, and then guac is you. Good. When they, when they have both, then I can just kind of turn my brain off and just press both buttons and throw caution to the wind where it belongs. I fucked up! Okay, there we go. Oh, I still fucked it up somehow. So many more stops. Uh, refried beans is B. Grammy is B. Yeah, I can, I'm like going slow. I just make sure I don't screw anything up. Simple. It's a tough one, but we're somehow. I mean, the nachos are the hardest part for me, at least. Oops. Chicken and food. Beans and food. Okay, this stop won't be quite as silly. To be a less silly stop. If my prediction holds true, and I can't see why it wouldn't. Oh boy. 
game chain. So they want everything except for not guacamole, but sour cream. Oh, wrong, wrong kind of fucking berries. Yep. I don't like that noise. I mean, things are going bad. It's bad when things go bad. Oh, fuck, wrong button. A lot, of, a lot of dumb mistakes. I wonder if that means I'm getting tired. I will need to wrap up in a little bit here. Oh, um, actually, that's okay. Yeah, that, that worked out well. Just in case, oh, they, they were easy on me for that one. They had mercy. Lord have mercy. Oh, they didn't want beef, or uh, beans, rather. They do want beef, but no beans. So... Okay. We got there. This next stop will be less silly. Although, we are running out of a lot of things. What was ice? Almond... Almond milk, I'm guessing. Almond. There we go. Mango is M? No, no. Mango is A. There it is. That, that, that one has got me in the past. Mango being M instead of A. I pressed the wrong button on that one. Sometimes it is A. Or sometimes it is M. So it's knowing the sometimes versus the always. Sarkin is S. All right. Need more prime rib. Oddly enough, we do not need tiramisu. Oops. We got everything else. Boba's ice, coconut, and seal. Boba ice, blueberry, seal. Look how blue that is. So cool. Cool blue, just like Gatorade. Beans and full. Pearl. Mother of pearl. Cheese and full. Chicken and fold. Cheese and fold. So, I do chicken, beef, sour cream, guac. All right. Yeah, I like when they get both, because then I don't have to think too hard about which kind of sauce to put down. I can just put both. Like I say, like I like to say, I could just turn my brain off and just press the buttons and, and feel happy about myself. What? I pressed the wrong button. Oh, whoops, they didn't want olives on this. Yeah, they're, they're not happy about that. Um, that's okay. That's okay. Gotta go fast for these. Okay. Okay, we're holding it down still. We're holding it down. Prunes. It's gonna be. I, I feel like I'm, I'm gonna like taking time to make sure I read the thing properly. We still have two more stops after this, so we are far from out of the woods. Let's make one of everything real quick, just because we're probably gonna need all of them. Pancakes just went bad, that's why I wanted to make more of them. I had three Gogurts, called it dinner. <laughs> oh, guys, I mean, as long as it's what your tummy can handle, Johnson, any food is valid food when you're when you're recovering from a not insignificant surgery when you had a literal organ extricated from your body. So any meal is a valid meal, Johnson. We'll take it. I, I hope it was, like, a good flavor. Can I ask what flavor yogurt? What, what flavor gurt? Oh, I pressed the wrong button, apparently. I screwed something up with that one, too. What did I do, what did I do wrong on that one? Chicken beef, sorry, can we walk? The worst is when you screw something up and it's like, fuck, I don't even know what I did wrong there. 
Other times it's like, oh yeah, I fucked up. I, I pressed the wrong button. Like sometimes it's super obvious. Other times not so much. This stuff went bad. It's just final stop. This music usually plays during the final stop. So it's like the audio signal to say like, all right, man, you're, you're nearing the finish line. You can just hold it down a little bit longer. Keep it in your pants just a little bit longer. Keep it in your pants a little bit longer and, oops, my penis fell out again. Not again. Keeps happening. Happens to the best of us. I mean, are you really- can you really call yourself a streamer if your penis doesn't, like, just accidentally fall out of your pants while you're streaming just from time to time? It's like, all those- all these things all of us streamers do all the time. We forget to unmute our mic, we forget to switch to the wrong scene, we forget to put our genitalia away. It happens. Nothing to be ashamed of. It happens to literally everyone. Every single person ever. Fold. Smack. Smacking the meats. We're good at beating- uh, Speaking of whipping genitalia out and whatnot, we're, we're, we're now beating our meats here on stream, so you know it's a party. Just beating our, beating our meats and slapping some cake. If cake is a different kind of vernacular, it kind of works. Looking fold. those pancakes. I was like, seasoning for pancakes? What the fuck? No, it's for the prime rib. I get my prime ribs and my pancakes mi mixed up sometimes. Oh, wrong fucking berries. God damn it. Yeah, when there's one nice thing, like in some cases like this, you see like, it's, it's called infinite nachos. You see just like the number, like the sheer number of things um, that are in, that are in that list of ingredients. Since I've played this game enough and I've, I've like seen the variations that some of the food items have, you kind of memorize what the definitions are. Like you memorize what the ingredients list are. So like I see how many there are. It's like, okay, I know that gets literally everything except guacamole. Bronze? Yeah, I figured that was a bronze. We had a lot of screw-ups. No, like, big fuck-ups, but just several small ones over time, and it added up. And I think if you get more than eight, then it can- it's, uh, yeah, that was well- well over eight. It's a bummer, because sometimes with some of these, you'll get, like, literally 500-plus orders. And granted, a lot of those are holding station orders where you can quickly plow through, but still, 500 orders, and then, like, you had nine screw-ups, and it's a bronze medal. It's like, dude, come on, that's such a small percentage. But at the same time, though, I, I get it. I, I, I get why they do it that way, because usually the bulk of them are things you can just press the go button on and you're good. Uh, Bloodlines is a source game. Right, right. Yeah, so, so alt-tabbing can be tricky. I, I usually can alt-tab okay with, like, original... Well, when you say source, you mean, like, gold source, right? Like, Half-Life 2? Well, actually, maybe that would have been, like, the like source, like, Half-Life... Or, Half-Life 1, rather. But, yeah, maybe it would have been a Half-Life 2 contemporary. I thought- I thought it was older than Half-Life 2 in Source. I thought it was Gold Source, like Half-Life 1 era. Also, Barry, what's up, bud? Super Hobbit end up with a GD Super Chef. A goddamn Super Chef. I'm gonna assume that means that's what GD means. I'm so good. Got some Carbonara Blackbird? Yes, that sounds wonderful. Whoever says they know Carbonara Sauce. Makes it for three dishes. For three main dishes? Oh, it's like, so wait, wait, you're saying like, you make a, you make a carbonara sauce and you don't get, you don't have very much of it. Is that the problem? Less than a cup of sauce. How do you, how do you divide? So is it like a, mesh, a matter of like quantity maybe? Triple X fajitas? Yes, we, we try to make it extremely sexy. The sauce is wrong, I don't want to be right. Stack of primary for my kid. Yeah, I was like, I saw the ingredients list. I, I expected it to see the blueberries and strawberries, but except I saw seasoning. I was like, what? What kind of pancakes are all these? 
the orange ecstatic reaction. So that happens when you have 80 perfect or uh, correct orders in a row. So then you get like the, yeah, the super happy orange ecstatic, like crackling energy. And that, yeah, that, that has to be done from, um, from the perfect orders, the perfect combos. They call them delicious, yeah, uh, for, they call them delicious servings. And the default is 80, however, there's an unlock you can unlock and in invest into to lower that threshold from 80 to 70, and then from 70 to 60, etc, etc. Um, it does get you more money, more crumb coins, so it is nice. It doesn't really unlock anything, it doesn't help you unlock anything, and it doesn't improve your overall metal rating, which is why I haven't invested into it. But it does help you earn more crumb coins. If you wanted to plow through crumb, cr 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 coins, that's, that's a different game. Crumb coins are for a different game, for a different platform. But uh, if you want to plow through the crumb coins, that's a good way to do it. So Half-Life 2 is- yeah, Source, yeah, Half-Life 1, but it gold, would have been Gold Source. Well, yeah, Bloodlines is Source, really? I thought Bloodlines was older than Half-Life 2. Interesting. It has issues with alt-tabbing, yeah. I was gonna say, I, usually for Half-Life 1, like, Gold Source games, I can alt-tab, okay? It's been a while since I played a Source game, though. I don't remember having problems, but it- it, it wouldn't shock me if it happened at some point. Counter-Strike Source came out before. You know what, you're right, it did come out before Half-Life Source, Half-Life 2. When it's loading transitions usually yeah i i don't i can't remember like obvious instances but it, it's probably happened at some point like i said i think part of it is that it's just been a long time since i've played a source game certainly on stream um i think like half-life deathmatch a couple years ago was probably the last time and i wouldn't have been doing a lot of alt tabbing there anyway um all right so 11 points this is a little spicy uh i can unlock quiche for the first time and i will and then i will also practice it Crust, potates, asparagus is A, spinach is the next tab, it's not N, but it's S, sometimes it's N. Tomatoes, mushrooms, egg batter, mozzarella, Just onions, asparagus, broccoli, egg batter, cheese, mozzarella, Just asparagus, chives is I, spinach, mushroom, egg batter is zozzarella, I like how mozzarella is always Z. Egg batter, cheese, and mozzarella. I actually had a quiche for the first time. Uh, they did one potato, so I might win. I had quiche for the first time ever. Um, about a week ago, Gracie made some, my, my wife made some really nice, um, some really nice quiche. And, of course, quiche typically gets a lot of cheese, but she made a specific, like, three or four of them that were very light on cheese that I was able to eat, and they were fucking incredible. Really, really lovely. They were like little quiche. Like, this is like a full quiche. She made like little, oh, what am I doing? She made little quiche, um, like little quiche, they're almost like muffins, like little mini quiche cakes. They were very, very pleasant, and I like them a bunch. Had a couple goofs there. Which tomatoes, mushrooms, I think we're good. There's always a risk, though. Something can, can back and back and happen. Yeah, I'll take your word for it. Like I said, I, I don't remember there being problems, but I'm, I'm pretty out of practice. With my with my source game knowledge, seven points necessary. We could do eggs Benedict and keep with the breakfast theme, although we're already in a breakfast theme anyway. Hamburgers are not too bad. I I feel like I need more practice with with chicken sandwiches. Let's do those. Um, I guess I'll do a three and a one. There. Uh, okay, here I'll I'll do. I would do it. I would do a two and two if that was an option, but there are no two options. So I will do this. Oh, whoops. Uh, stuffed peppers. Then I'll do griddle eggs. The griddles. Depends on the game, probably. It wouldn't shock me if it depended on the game as well as the, you know, the the, the, the everything. You know, someone's rig, their operating system, their all the things they have running at the time, if they're streaming or not, or any kind of video capture. Good luck today. That's that's the great thing about computer games is how impossible it can sometimes be to try to diagnose problems between two people with like similar but different rigs. So many chimkins, so little time. This is gonna be a big, 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 big one. That'll do it. So crust, potatoes, spinach, tomatoes, mushroom, egg butter, zozzarella. Zesty. Should make better mozzarella. Little pepper cut. Spinach is S and cheese. Chef says, uh, spinach, tomatoes, mushroom, egg butter, mozzarella. 
potato, asparagus. Oh, cool. So meat and feta is F. You feta believe it. Ham is H sausages. You are right. It's quite a thick. Eesh, my goodness. Uh, oh, there it is. This was some top button. Top button is O. O as in, oh yes, give me that top button. Big top button daddy. That's what they mean. It's definitely what they're saying. Sometimes they want pickles, but not always. Not always with the pickles. Uh, I screwed something up. What? Oh, I forgot the Swiss cheese in that one. Shit, man. Man, I've had several screw-ups in a row. the noise like I just dropped an order. I didn't see it go down. It's a little bit weird. That was good. Mm, it was it not again. very good. I, yeah, I, had a, I had a lot of just strange and simple goofs. So I, gotta, I guess I still gotta get good. That's why I picked the chicken sandwich because the grilled chicken sandwich because I can tell it's something I, I need more practice with. Something where it's so easy for me to like just instantly Accidentally drop a uh, drop an input or drop an order. I'm going to assume we need more of both, most likely. And we do. My 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 senses were correct. My Spidey senses. If that is, if Spider-Man was exclusively a food truck chef. And that was all he did, and didn't really, and wasn't really so focused on saving the day and stopping bad guys, all that jazz. What I'm saying is, I'm pretty much exactly like him in every way, in every way possible. Right. That was an easy stop. So that, that first stop was a doozy, but all subsequent stops so far have been better. I'm, ex I'm expecting the last one's gonna be a real dick grinder. A real... a real butt slapper. A real appendix sniffer. A real eyebrow slicer. Um, what's... oh, rice. Right, there it is, yeah. Started this one. Whoops. I think they were being very, ba very, uh, very strangely patient, like uncharacteristically patient, for the customers in this game, or at least for this level of the game, because we're starting to get more impatient peoples. There we go. What else do we need? We have actually we need more. We need mo. so much so actually no we will have just enough just enough and slaunch was L jeez spinach and feta on it chef you fed to believe it. I already used that joke, but I'm not above using it again. I'm all about recycling. That includes dumbass hu uh, humor, dumbass jokes. I'm not above going for the low-hanging fruit. But when you're short like I am, you tend to learn. You tend to live and die by low-hanging fruits. It's kind of your thing. After a while, kind of my thing. After a while. Oh, I don't like that noise. That means something just went bad. I, I think it's bad that it went bad. 
I've had a screw up in a while though, which is kind of neat. Which means it's high time I drop an order like- Well, not drop an order, but screw up an order like that. I think I forgot the, the lettuce in that one. Not the pickles. I remember the pickles, but not the lettuce. Heck, maybe that's what I was dropping earlier. Uh, oh, they didn't want lettuce in that one, yeah. Whoa, that noise means some attractive person just raided me. Attractive person, I bet they are very charming, and I bet they've got a great ass, whoever this person is. Hold on, I will address you accordingly and compliment your great, juicy fucking uh, behind in a moment. Um, as soon as I get a chance, hopefully it's, hopefully it's somebody that I already know, and I didn't just fucking creep somebody way the fuck out, and they were like, whoa, easy, Alex, we've only just met. And you know nothing about my ass. Don't you assume. And I'll say, hey, listen here. If you're on this Twitch.television website and you're rating my short ass, it means you probably have a great ass. Oh, it is. It is Maddie. Okay, well, I don't know much about Maddie. Uh, Maddie's ass specifically, but Maddie's a cool person. Thank you, Maddie, for that raid. Maddie says, what the hell? <laughs> what have I done? Rating this this short, weirded, weird freaking dude. We're playing a game called Cooks Are Delicious, and admittedly, it is sometimes challenging for me to take my eyes off this video game to address the chat and to thank very kind raiders such as yourselves. Uh, what am I doing? Let's do broccoli on this. Especially because we are... You can hear in the music, it's like all spicy right now. It's like getting weird. And I need to make sure I minimize heck ups because I think I think I might already be like kind of past the, the point of no return. I think we might already have to just take the bronze on this one and not get a silver medal. You're always like graded at the end of one of these, one of these where you're, you're trying to like get a gold medal or a silver medal, um, or or a bronze. I mean, a bronze is fine too. It's not great, but it's it'll get the job done. Oh boy, I'm gonna drop some of these. I think I'm gonna drop one apparently. Bacon and bacon, and Swiss tomato, egg and cheese. Oh, and Swiss top line. Cool. So yeah, we dropped a couple of these. Yeah, I, I think by this point we've probably screwed the pooch. When it comes to clutching out a silver, but that's okay. Bronze gets the job done. Bronze is like, bronze is like the equivalent of getting a B, or, or I'm sorry, getting getting a, getting a C in, uh, in in school and college. And you know, so you know what they say, uh, C's get degrees. So I I feel only a little bit of shame. My mom's not going to see my report card. She doesn't have to know. She just has to know I got the degree, and that's all that matters. We are getting there. I forgot the lettuce. Oh no. Bubble bass moment all over again. No lettuce, Alex. I can't do a good bubble bass impression, but I would try. Need more uh, thingies. These things. Fucking chicken things. Chicken slabs. Let's get cut up on chat while we're waiting. Thank you again to Maddie. Thank you very much. Thank you again to Maddie for that raid. That's, that's so sweet. Thank you, my friend. Holy shit. And being patient for my dumb ass when I'm blindly just shouting out booty themed epi epitaph epithets epit epithets uh, co comments commentary thank you my friend i really appreciate that um i will uh not screw that up i forgot the pickles okay that that was a bubble bath bubble bath moment no pickles um i'm gonna win i'm gonna get this shit never even broke a sweat easy fucking easy um, give me the news. Yeah, bronze, I figured. That's okay. I'll take it. I'll take it. Really great work, chef. Sometimes things work on one system and other. Exactly. That's just that's just how it goes with PC gaming especially. PC gaming and PC and PC streaming too. Wish it was just right for the for the stuff you made, Blackbird. I gotcha. Yeah. Yeah, for the or for the food you were making. That's good stuff. That's good stuff. Thank you again to Maddie. Maddie was doing some Final Fantasy. Maddie, how um, how are you liking Final Fantasy? Are, are, have you put like a lot of time into it, or are you only just recently getting into it? Because I, um, I was just talking to to a couple friends about that game not too long ago, and it is it's a game I don't know if I'm ever gonna play anytime soon, but it's kind of on my radar because I'm really picky when it comes to MMOs, and I'm I'm kind of. I'm I'm hard to please when it comes to him when it comes to them, but it it does seem like it's a pretty special game even if you're not into MMOs like myself. 
Maddie says, you're, you're asking for trouble, sir. Wait, 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 I'm sorry. Maddie, I need to direct you to how you spelled the word asking. Does the word asking have two S's? Or are you saying that I am the asking? Because I that is a crown I don't know if I'm worthy of. I'm a, I'm a short glass of water. I'm not- I can't even call myself a short stack, because I'm like really scrawny, so... I- I thank you for the offer, but I might have to respectfully decline this crown of the ass king. I- I mean, I, I've got some buddies who- I mean, they've- anyway, not, not, let's not- let's not get too ahead of ourselves. I mean, have you seen Jet's ass? I mean, whoo, buddy. Anyway, on, let's- <clears throat> sorry, I'm getting- whew, now I'm the one getting flustered. The greatness of Maddie, yes. Fanta- no, no matter the angle. Ep more like epitaph. That's right. That's right. There we go. Good stuff, my friends. Good stuff. Played it. Played fourteen. Oh wait, no. Hold on. Did I misread? I thought it was fourteen. Oh, it's nine. I'm a. It turns out I don't know how to count. I don't know how to read. I don't know how to count. Final Fantasy nine. Got you. Yes. So that's the, that's one of the older single player ones. Yeah. You've played it a bunch. That's awesome. That's fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. Not the MMO. Yeah. Yeah. Different. Different Final Fantasies. Different Final Fantasies. What's up, Rationalize? The pun was intended. That's that's actually fucking incredible. That's awesome. Maddie, thank you so much for that, Ray. Thank you for for your understanding where I was blindly throwing booty comments out there with reckless abandon. Imagine if I would have like, you know, it's like I uh, it's like I I, I I I'm throwing out some booty compliments, and then the person that's raids me is like, actually, Alex, I, I had my my booty had to be surgically removed as a child. I I would feel like the biggest asshole ever, honestly. Um, but, uh, but yeah, it, so it's, so you've played through nine a whole bunch of times and, uh, yeah, 11's an MMO. Yeah. Yeah. I think nine, I think I, I, I've only, I haven't, I haven't really played a ton of Final Fantasy. Of course, everyone knows seven and I know a decent bit about eight. I don't know much about nine. Is nine the one where there's the fella that looks like the standard black mage, but he's like a named fella. And there's the, like the, the, the designs are kind of more cartoonish. Your thought, oh, oh, th thought patrol. I was like, what? It's like thoughts patrol. Like, like I'm in deep thinking, deep thunk. That's the one. Gotcha. What are some other things you have planned for for future streamy strams? Does it occur to me if you're if you're plowing through nine, you're you might not have very far to go because you you obviously you've obviously played it a lot before, so you you probably know the game pretty dang well. By the way, we can add one, only one new thing to our menu. We can add sashimi. A wok dish with beef and pork, okonomiyaki or hiyayaka tofu. Hiyayako tofu. Um, I am kind of leaning towards sashimi. It can be complicated, but it might be worth. It might be worth. Or we could just do the. This is probably the safer option, even though it's more expensive. We've done. We've. Do I have these? Yeah, we have the, we have the shrimp one. We have the chicken one. Oh, prop night. Yeah. Oh, that's perfect, Maddie. That's perfect. It's it was the stars aligned to make that happen. That'll be perfect. Then yeah, that'll be fun. Cause yeah, prop night. That's the that's like the multiplayer prop hunt thing, right? Would you do solo queues or would you want to play with homies? Cause that might be kind of fun to watch if you got like some homies that play the game. I've I've never played it myself, but it uh it's I've watched like some multiplayer streams. That's that is perfect, Maddie. You you, you would need to well you don't need to but I you would. Your chat might respond very well to you mimicking the voice when you achieve a kill. I demand rule. Yeah, yeah, they, they ought to pay you properly. Let's do, yeah, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do sashimi. I'm fucking doing it. Let's do a quick practice. See what I'm getting myself into exactly. Mackerel, what's that word? Skipjack tuna? Uh, so this is gonna be tough. Squid is Q, wasabi, W. A sea beam is B, shrimp, and gingers. This is one where you just gotta learn the shortcuts and get good. Mackerel is MC. Usually mackerel is K, so that's weird. Uh, weird for us. Sea urchin, octopus is O, squid, wasabi, shrimp, tuna, and scallop. So we just gotta learn the shortcuts and get good. Uh, surf clam. Surf clam. What an odd... What an odd name. I mean, these are all kind of weird, but sashimi... Sashimi is... I mean, it's just raw fish, so it, it's gonna be weird to some. Just including me. Yeah, the second tab is much easier because we already know most of these anyway from previous things. Skipjack tuna. Skip skipjack tuna sounds like someone's nickname. Good old skipjack tuna. Classic skipjack tuna move right there. A surf clam, octopus, wasabi, sea beam, shrimp, tuna, scallop. Yeah, I think we get to the base just 
go ahead and buy it add it to my menu and then the rest i'm gonna make real a as easy as i can get some onigiri up in this up, up in this thing and then some egg fuyong there we go 15 point uh thingamajig we're probably gonna wrap up after this uh day after this after this uh series of stops we're about to embark on nepsid good to see you my friend what is horngry well see the way it works is that there is standard desire of food which we all know as being hungry and then there's the feeling of being very hungry and you're mad about it and you're angry so it's so it's hangry but sometimes sometimes you are so hungry you think to yourself, God damn it, I need, I need food inside me, or I need something else inside me, or I need to be inside something else. Sometimes, like, sometimes the brain just kind of stops working a little bit, and it short circuits, and other primal urges erupt, or you wish to erupt. Uh, this is a very real physiological phenomenon that I just, that I definitely didn't just make up for the sake of a dumb tag. But, um, but that is, that is the etymology of Horngree. And it is probably a very real thing. You know what? I, I bet, I bet somebody in the world somewhere has had this happen. They were like, you know what? I can't, I can't get food right now, but I can get, I can get something else to catch my drink. Surely I'm not the only one. Where, or, I, ooh, ooh, sorry, I revealed a little bit too much about myself there. Surely I'm not the first one to imagine this hypothetical. Uh, tuna. Yeah, sushi's a tough one. Sushi's a tough one this game. We gotta make even more. Sesame, avocado, mayo, and for crab. Oh, fried crab, of course. Cut, 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 cut. Shwing, 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 shwing. And there we go. So that's all we can do for now. So, skipjack tuna and surf clam and octopus and wasabi and sea beam shrimp tuna scallop. We're doing that. We're doing it, man. We're getting there. We're getting there. Uh, sea urchin is you. Octopus, squid, wasabi, shrimp tuna, scallop. All right. Uh, every time I enter the inputs for that, it's it's S. It's G W P. G W P. I always think I'm saying like well played. I do it. I did not do it correctly, but I mo got most of it. Oh, whoops. It's like I'm saying, well played, like G well played, like good well played, like good game well played. I don't even know if that's a weird thing, like an actual thing people say to each other in online video games. Bit of a rough start. Had a couple, I think just one goof. So not too bad, make more sushi. I didn't even like appreciate, I didn't like take time to notice that we were making sushi as part of this menu. And it's kind of tough, but I think I just got to get good and learn by doing. Also, I fucked up that first order there. I pressed the wrong button. I hope they don't spank me too harshly, and if they do spank me too harshly, I hope they at least apply some lotion afterwards or something. It's the right thing to do. Rice, sesame, salmon, and crab. Raw crab and then fried crab. What an interesting juxtaposition. Oh, this. Right. Um... Beans, sprouts, mushroom, onions, scallions, pork, and shrimp. They want everything. Beans, sprouts, mushroom, onions, shrimp, and scallions. But not pork. Got it. Has anybody here ever had dango, by the way? Because I never have. And every goddamn time I play this game, I'm like, damn, I don't know what dango- I don't know what dango is. I think they're like rice balls. Like steamed rice balls, but they look incredible. They're so colorful. It's just so neat. Let's do it again. Beans, sprouts, mushrooms, onions, scallions. They want the pork. They want the pork this time. Yeah, I forgot the D last time. I forgot the D. So unlike me to forget the D. What the fuck is wrong with me? Forgetting the D in a horn tree tag stream. What the fuck is wrong with me, man? This is my edge. Oh, wrong button. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I've had a couple of kind of some dumb mistakes in this round. But we can turn the beat around. So salmon, and then mayo, asparagus, fried crab. Oh, roll it twice, and then cut that shit. 
a bunch. We need to make actually a lot more sushi. That's gonna be a problem. Salmon, and asparagus, and fried crab. Scallions and pork. All right. Skip jack tuna. Octopus wasabi. Uh, oh, B. Yeah, okay, cool. We're getting ripped. Oh, out of corn. We got there. So you have to make more sushi as well. I'm trying to look for a good opportunity to kind of break away from like reacting to everything. And get some sushi on. But that is a tall order, and when you are five foot three like I am, tall orders are kind of not your specialty. Nice sesame shrimp, sesame asparagus. Okay, just in the nick of time. Those go, and I think we're in good shape, my friends. Oh, wrong order, wrong button, but that's okay. I need more of that stuff. More of those things. Oh, I guess I'm wrong. I thought I needed sushi, but I guess I didn't. If one more stop after this. Oh, you know what? We actually might still be able to clutch out a, a silver medal. We might be able to, at, at the last minute, we might be able to pull out for a, for a gold medal. And you know, or for a silver medal. And you know what? There is something to be said about being really good at pulling out um, at the last possible minute. You know, sometimes, sometimes you gotta, look, gotta seek out the danger, right? Sometimes that's the joy. Sometimes that's the joy in life. Uh, what are we talking about again? Making sushis. Uh, sesame, avocado, salmon. Bean sprouts, onions. Is that everything they want? Er thing. All right. I want the Cadillac. You got it, fam. Ask you shall receive. Onions and scallions. Sashimi, salmon, mackerel, surf clam, urchin, squid, wasabi, shrimp, and scallop. All right, we got there. Music always gets me going, man. It's stressful, but it's a enjoyable stressful. I'm actually gonna need more corn. We do. We always use more corn in our lives. Hardcore corn. As a Midwestern denizen, not even that. As somebody who grew up in Illinois, we are all about our hardcore corn. Oh Jesus. We're also about our Jesus too, but that's something else entirely. Going fast. Calm down. Calm, calm your titties, corn people. Jesus Christ. Where's the fire? Where's the corn laden fire? Okay. Did we pull out in time for a silver? Did we get a pull out, pulling out silver medal? <sighs> what a gamer. Hell yeah. That was tough, but we, we fucking slapped it out. Not bad. A strong desire to centrally consume. You know what? That is also valid. We'll, we'll take that as well, Wired Wolf. Wasabi inside of rolls? Wasabi inside of rolls. Oh, oh, wait, for the sashimi? Oh, for the sushi. Right, right, right. I got you, I got you. Yeah, was yeah wasabi inside the sushi rolls. That is kind of devious. <laughs> oh, that's right, Jen. Yeah, because you were here earlier, actually. Like, rice balls are easy to make. They look so pretty, though. They look so pretty. I mean, I guess that's a thing, though, like... If they're just rice balls skewered, there would probably need to be some other way to kind of dress them up a little bit. Rice cooker, yeah, yeah, I know what you meant, yeah. That's how you get a high, yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's that's playing with danger, man, playing with fire. Decent pullout game, that's right, only one kiddo, yeah. Yeah, was, yeah, one one impregnation for every every uh, dropped order or missed order. Well, thank you uh, to Maddie as well as Rational, uh, as well as, um, well, thank you Rationalize for being here, I just saw your screen name, uh, to, uh, to Wired Wolf. As well as Mystic Soul. We had three people rate us tonight, which is very nice. Maddie, thanks for being patient with my fucking degenerate ass. I don't know what gets into me sometimes. I, I think like it happens when I get a little bit tired. My my parts of my brain shut down and my my inhibitors that you know, because I've got a robot brain, right? Like my inhibitors start to not function as properly, so I tend to just start fucking I tend to just start fucking no, I, I tend to just start letting shit fly and and uh <laughs> 
I need to remember that's like, all right, man, not not everybody is as down for the DJ nonsense as, as I certainly am. But I appreciate everyone for being here. Thank you again to Maddie. We had Wired Wolf as well and Mystic Soul hitting us with some raids. Had a couple new follows, had some new folks stop in, which was nice. As well as, of course, lots of familiar faces.